My mind run deep in my thoughts when I didn't have it. Sleeping on the floor, wishing it was a mattress. Now I'm in Hollywood with actors and actress. Where everybody bougie, latest trends and fashions. I'd rather keep it a buck, a hundred if you ask me. I was trying to pay the bills just like last week. I was trying to sell a deal just like last week. Trying to run plays and run it up like the math leak. It's in my DNA to have hope and make a way. Good energy will hit that MJ fade away. Miss me with the hate in now, bruh, not today. Stayed in my lane, they complain this is meant for me. Whatever come my way, this was meant for me. Trying to share my story, this is history. Now it's not a mystery. Stop with all the hating, dog, man, this is meant for me. Whatever come my way, this was meant for me. Trying to share my story, this is history. Now it's not a mystery. Stop with all the hating, dog, man, this is meant for me. By guns be by guns. I'ma keep rapping till I turn into an icon. Back against the ropes, kept swinging like Tyson. Back in the booth now, snapping as a python. Had to rise up to the horizon. Use my words to connect, no Verizon. Speak the truth, I'ma show you, chase your dreams. I'm living proof, not the industry type, but I'ma grind from the roots. Ooh, see my family struggle from the start. I'ma change the trajectory. Put some respect to me. Plant the seeds daily, foundation, that's the recipe. If you walked in my shoes, then you knew this meant for me. Whatever come my way, this was meant for me. Trying to share my story, this is history. Now it's not a mystery. Stop with all that hating, dog, man, this is meant for me. Whatever come my way, this was meant for me. Trying to share my story, this is history. Now it's not a mystery. Stop with all that hating, dog, man, this is meant for me. I mean, look, at the end of the day, I'm here to be the voice for the people and break the generation. Everybody, welcome to Game Season Live. It is indeed the rubber match as the Toronto Blue Jays take on our New York Yankees, baby. What is going on, everybody? And welcome to the one, the only a Game Season Live. Okay, had to get that. You gotta, you gotta open the lungs up, folks. It's just the way it has to be done. People could sit there and go, "This guy's out of his mind." No, you gotta open the lungs up. That's the way it works, baby. But guys, we are in the rubber match, as of course the Blue Jays will be taking on the Yankees in the beautiful old Bronx. And hopefully, Luis Hill is on the bump today, and he goes ahead and gets the job done, baby. We are actually just about ready for game time. Luis Hill will indeed be on the bump. But before we do all that, I got to say hi to the greatest, the best, the most entertaining community that any Yankee fan has ever put together. The NYYU community. Philo, what's up, my brother? Tony Sandwiches is in the house. Let me tell you something. When you got Tony Sandwiches here, you know today's stream is going to be rather delicious. I'm just telling you right now. Pete holds more notes than Otani's bookie, Hirsch. We always know it's a party when Hirsch is here. Old Sarge, strength and honor. My brother Gark Balls is in the chat. How you doing? We got Scotty Wright. Robert, how you doing, Robert? Lois Simmons, Anthony Medina, Timothy Cochran, Tina, Eric, Dominic, Davis, I really want somebody's name just to come up as Dominic the Donkey because I love Dominic the Donkey so much, man. Zachary, how you doing? Zachary, how you doing? Smacky the likey, hitty the damn, a sub sub. Alex! El Diablo! DJ 
Jay Steals with a super chat. I need the NYYU app now, bro. Where is it? I am going to give this guy the greatest. I'm going to give him a bear hug that Zeus used to do back in the day. Remember Zeus? Tiny Adebo from Friday? I am going to give him one of those bear hugs on April 20th. I'm just telling you guys right now, he's getting one of those for a minute. If everybody wants to just stand around and take photos and stuff like when people stand around and take photos of like the baby dolphin taken out of the ocean and the poor thing <laughs> and idiots are just taking pictures. That's what we're going to do. We're going to go ahead and give uh, DJ Steels a gigantic bear hug for a good five minutes straight. Uh, I think I could do it. I, I think we can make that happen. Uh, the NYYU app, you sons of bitches, man. You guys are going to probably make me start looking into this nonsense. Anyway, I'm not looking into it yet, okay? I'm not looking into it yet, damn it. Desiree Conrad, how are you doing? Anthony Garcia, Christina, how are you doing? Smacky the like, like, hitty the subby. Vikings, what's up, my brother? Robert, Jacob Petrucci. Jacob Petrucci is in the chat. Guy La Sorsa, what's going on, guy? How you doing, Melanie? Jared, what is up, Jared? How you doing, fam, fam? Big time, Jerry. Connor O'Neill. What is going on, Connor O'Neill? We got everybody here today, guys. It is, of course, a beautiful Sunday. And we are just set for baseball. Of course, tomorrow, guys, the New York Yankees will be taking on the Miami Marlins, who seems like they can't win a game. That always scares me. That always scares me when they can't win, and then you got to play them. And you never know what's going to happen. You never know what's going to happen. Kerry, what's up, Kerry? Manu. How you doing, Manu? Jordan. God, we got everybody here today. Christopher Flood, JP Yankee fan. Yo, what is going on, everybody, man? I'm so happy all you people are here. I love this. This is beautiful. This is a community, baby. I always say it, guys. Let's take it easy. We're in a community. A community is about love. It's about friendship. It's about honor and strength, old Sarge. Strength and honor, my brother. William Henry, what's going on? How you doing, everybody? Guys, we got a ball game to call. Keith, what up, Keith? Twiggy, what up, Twiggy? There he is. The man of the hour, Luis Hill, is on the hill. Guys, let's switch on over to as a mother bud because we got a ball game to call. Here we go, baby. And as you guys can see, yesterday's goal was 24,300. We indeed broke that goal. As right now, we are sitting at 24,322. And who knows where we get to today. Let's just hang out, call a ball game, have a good time. Hopefully the Yankees don't make it as scary as they did yesterday. And let's hope they go ahead and get the victory. Here is Georgie Boy Springer pitch. High up and in, almost hits him. Well, that's the way to start a game. I like it, actually. It didn't almost hit him. It was it was far away, but it brushed him off. I like it. This guy started both games with doubles. Eh, give him a little something to worry about. Inside, and the count is two and one. Uh, looks like I actually missed uh, the first pitch of the, the second pitch of the game. I don't know how that happened. But the count is two and one on Springer. Pitch. Hit on the ground. Foul. The count is two and two. Let's start early with Luis Hill. Come on, baby. Angel Hernandez behind the plate today. Good old Angel Hernandez. 2-2. Two -two. Hit in the air to left field. Not deep. Who's it going to be? Coming in. Still coming in. Doogie will make the catch. And there's one away. Doogie with yellow cleats today in left field. I keep it real with you guys for a second. I ain't a big fan of that look. The yellow cleats kind of killed the uniform for me. I got to be honest with you guys. I got to be honest with you guys, man. Those that kind of kind of ruins the uniform for me. Maybe it'll grow on me. I don't know. But that was, those yellow cleats kind of look a bit ugly for me with the with the white and the and the pinstripes. First pitch is high 1 and 0 on Vladdy.
<clears throat> yeah, those yellow cleats, man. That's looking a that's a that's a bit off with my with the Yankee Uni. The one one is fouled away, and we'll do the one two again. Let's keep it going. <laughs> Yeah, Vladdy's a strange dude, man. How are you going to... I think, you know what? I'll be honest. I don't think he has much upstairs, to be honest. The pitch is low. Two and two. I'm not trying to be a dick when I say this. I don't think Vladdy has much upstairs. I'm being honest with you guys. I don't think he's the most intelligent guy out there, to be honest. Because how smart can you be to shush a crowd when you're down by seven? I mean, come on, really. Pitch. Hey! Struck him out. Bye bye. Hey. Shh. Shh. Two away. That changeup is absolute filth. That changeup is so much better than when we first seen Luis Hill. It's not even close. Not even close. First pitch to Bichette is outside, and the count is 1 0. It'll be nice to see Luis Hill have a couple of nice, quick innings. Make sure he gets past that fifth. Pitch is a good game. Will be nice. 1-0 is outside. 2-0. 2-0. Oh. Two and oh, uh, smacky to likey. Hitty the sub-sub. Tommy likey. Oh, Tommy want wingy. Tommy want wingy. This one fouled away, and the count is now 2-1. and one. Val, what's going on, Val? Michael Finnegan. What's up, Michael Finnegan? How are you doing to save situation? What's up, my guy? How you doing? 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 Two and one on Bichette. The... Taking some time here, okay? I'm uh, going to step out, step back in. All right, smack the like, hit the sub. You know the deal, okay? Two, one pitch. Swing and a miss. And the count is two and two. Let's put him away. Just a bit outside. Mateo. Finally get to catch a game with uh with a goat. Uh you're the goat, my guy. I appreciate it. Pitch. Low, and he walks him. Good at bat right there by Bichette as he lays off the tough changeup. And there'll be a two-out walk. That'll bring up Alejandro Kirk. That'll bring up Alejandro Kirk. Johnny Almonte, what's going on, my guy? How you doing? Smack you to like, like. Hit you the sub, sub, everyone. Okay, thank you. Oh, ladies and gentlemen, NYYU is on a mission this year. We are on a mission this year, folks. Pitch is in there for a call strike. 0 and 1. Change up the Kirk. And Alejandro Kirk hitting 185. I would have sworn he got like seven hits off the Yankees this series. I feel like this guy gets a hit against the Yankees every time up. The 0 1 incoming from Luis Hill. Pitch is low. And the count is one and one. NYYU, mission to the moon, baby. We're going on up. We're going on up. My MLB TV is uh, breaking my balls today. Pickoff attempt at first. He's back. I tell you what, it's breaking my balls today is what it's doing. There we go. Now I think I'm straight. Let's see. Let's hope it's straight now. The 1-1 and coming to Kirk. Pitch in there for a strike. And the count is 1-2. and two. Let's keep doing this, man. It's so annoying. It's doing that thing that I talk about every now and then when it keeps sending me to the beginning of the game. I don't know why it does that. 1-2 and two count. Come on, baby. Come on, chat. Where you at? Come on, baby. 1-2 is high. High from Luis Hill, sitting at 95 on that one. Believe it or not, for his fastball, that's actually down in velo. <laughs> Believe it or not, when he's throwing 94, 95, that's actually down in velo. 2-2, two, two, pickoff attempt again. Back is Bichette. Count remains 2-2. Two and two. 
And now what you want to do if you're Luis Hill is you're at 20 pitches already. You got to get this out. You got to just, you got to get them out here. You don't want this inning to extend any further. Timeout is called by Kirk. We will wait for the 2-2. We will wait for the 2-2. Runner on first base, two away. The 2-2 pitch. Foul, hit on the ground, a third. Thought it was going to be a foul ball at first. Fires over, got him. That will end the inning. So a good inning for Luis Hill. Threw a little more pitches than you wanted him to. But at the end of the day, it is a Cheerio on the board for the Toronto Blue Jays. Yankees coming on up. They will face uh, Bowden Francis. Bowden Francis will be on the mound for the Jays. Torres, Soto, and Judge. And guys, I'm going to say it right now before anybody else does. I believe today is the day Soto hits his first home run as a New York Yankee at Yankee Stadium. That is my prediction for today. If anybody else has any predictions, feel free to share them right now. Feel free to throw those predictions in the chat right now. Because that's what I believe is going to happen. That's what I think is going to happen today. Patrick says it's going to happen. Let's go. I like it. I like it. I like it. Dominic says, I feel you, Pete. Yep, I think so. <laughs> Christina says, Kirk is looking like a Oompa Loompa. Oh, man. He kind of he has a little Oompa Loompa going on. No doubt about it. He does have a little Oompa Loompa. Let's be real here. He does have a little Oompa Loompa. I hope Soto homers today, says Keith. I think so. Doogie goes yard, says Connor O'Neill. Uh, Bowden isn't the only Francis who hits the 90s. <laughs> Let me tell you something. There ain't nobody. There ain't nobody like Hirsch. Three home runs today, Judge, Soto, and Volpe. That would be awesome to see. I would love to see all three of those guys hit some home runs today. We got Ronnie in the chat. What is going on, my brother? How you doing? How you doing? How you doing? Chris, what's up, Chris? Sparks, how you doing, everybody? Smacky that like, like. Hitty that sub, sub, baby. Let's get this off the screen and let's get to it. Let's get to it, baby. Let's get to it. There is Bowden Francis. First time around, it says uh, basically two. So I'm assuming if they say basically two, maybe that means he's a two-pitch pitcher. I'll be honest with you guys. I have no idea um, who Bowden Francis is. No idea whatsoever. First pitch to Glaber is outside, and the count is 1-0. 1-0. Oh. Oh. 1-0 incoming to Glaber. Pitch is high. Oh, gets the call strike. And the count is 1-1. One one. Stone ZD. What up, Stone ZD? How you doing? Smack you that like. Hit you the damn sub. Adam DeSocio. Swing and a miss. 94 miles an hour upstairs. And the count is quickly 1-2 and two on Glaber Torres. One and two on Glaber. Pitch. Fouled away. That one stood up. Breaking pitch stays up in the zone. And he fouls it away. Mr. Ra Thompson with the super chat. Let me see this pitch and then we'll get right to it. The one, two. Fouled away. Peace. Uh, 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 uh. Ross says, uh, Pete, is it safe to say we've seen the last of Loisiga? Will we ever see Verdugo leading off? Yes, it is safe to see, safe to say we have seen the last of Jonathan Loisiga. I think it's time for the Yankees to move on. He's going to be a free agent anyway. The uh, two, one, two is high, two and two. Um, but when it comes to the top of the order, Yankees haven't done it against righties yet. I don't know why. I don't think we're going to see it. It's like the same thing they, do, they did to um, Andrew Benintendi. Everybody expected he's a leadoff hitter, and they don't put him there. 
This one popped up, and that is going to go foul again. So a nice long at bat. So if Glaber Torres is doing anything here, he's doing a job as a leadoff hitter in this situation. He's about to throw pitch number eight of the AB. Joshua, what's going on, my guy? Gene, how you doing, Gene? Pitch is high behind his head. And the count is three and two on Glaber. Excellent at bat. He is going to see pitch number nine of the AB coming up right now from Bowden Francis. The three, two. He struck him out. I don't know what happened. Glaber stepped out of the box. And here comes Aaron Boone. And now all the umpires are getting together. Angel Hernandez, I guess, didn't see it. They're going to see if they're going to talk to the other umps. Regular Angel Hernandez here. Let's see. This one should come back. The umpires are going to discuss this here. Let's see it here. Let's see what he's talking about. Oh, yeah. He stepped off. How does Angel Hernandez not see that, bro? Come on, man. The fuck is Angel Hernandez doing back there? This got to be overturned. They got to redo the pitch. He stepped off. He stepped off. It's as clear as day. He stepped off. Come on now. You guys can't miss this. Glaber got a point. I don't think they're going to overturn this. I don't think they're going to overturn this. Wow. Wow. It is indeed a strikeout on Glaber Torres. They are not going to change this. He stepped off, which means he has to take a timeout. He steps back on the mound and he strikes him out. Glaber did the right thing. He stepped back. He's sitting back going, he stepped off. So here is Soto and there's one away. I can't believe what I'm seeing here. Four umpires can't figure this shit out. He stepped off. That means it's a dead ball. Pitch is high, 1-0. Oh. Wow. Unbelievable. Nah, Glaber Torres did nothing wrong. Glaber Torres did nothing wrong. When a pitcher steps off, you back out because there's a timeout. 2-0. and 2-0 oh. oh on Soto. Wow. I tell you, man, my goodness, what a joke. What a friggin' joke. Joshua. Thank you for being a friend. There's a call strike, and the count is two and one. 13 walks after an 0-2 count since last season is the most in the major leagues for Soto. Pitch is low, and the count is three and one. How Angel Hernandez still has a job and there's nobody in the minor leagues that can replace him is rather shocking, to be honest. It tells you the state of Major League umpiring. It's disgraceful. 3-1 is fouled away right down to Johnson. And the count is 3-2. and 3-2. Two. Three and 3-2 two. Three, two, incoming to Soto from Francis. Pitch. He struck him out. Wow. Soto chases a ball low, and he goes down swinging this two away. It's two away. Umpire's union is thug life. A bad enough dude. You ain't wrong about that. You ain't wrong about that. You are not wrong about that. Gustavo, what's going on, my guy? How you doing, fam fam? What's up, Gustavo? How you doing? Pitch is outside the judge, 1-0. It looks like Aaron Judge may be finding himself. And that is a very, very good sign for the New York Yankees. Judge now up to 212. Two home runs. Pitch from Francis is a call strike on the black. And the count is 1-1. One one. Speaking of Francis... Designated spit is tonight live, 8 p.m. Tonight live at 8 p.m. Designated spit is time, baby. 
Swing and a miss. Challenge them right down to Johnson. And the count is one and two. One and two. One, two, and coming to judge the pitch inside. And the count is even at two and two. Count is even at two and two. Irish Rover, Elizabeth Simmons. I don't. I don't. Two, two, and coming. My game is frozen. Here's the pitch. High calls it a strike. And that'll end the inning. Let's see the pitch again. Ah, you might give it to him. Yeah, that's a strike. Judge is a tall guy. That's a strike. I'll give it to him. I'll give it to Angel Hernandez on that one. That's a strike, in my opinion. Oh, my guy. Aaron Rodgers says, what's worse, Manoa's ERA in, the sing in single A or Angel Hernandez? Both is the correct answer. Aaron Rodgers, you are indeed correct, my friend. You are indeed correct. Uh, Jacob says, Pete, I get it, but isn't the batter taught to stay in the box until the ump calls timeout? You're not wrong about that, but when you see a, when you see a pitcher step off, that means he's taking the timeout. That means he's taking the timeout. I'm not blaming Glaber Torres on that one. Glaber did nothing wrong. If I'm sitting up there batting, and I'm ready, and I'm in my, in, my, in my stride to get ready to hit, and I see the pitcher take a step off the mound, first thing I'm thinking of, okay, let me settle back. He's taking a timeout. I'm not going to sit there and act like Glaber's meant to be perfect. Same exact thing I would have done, to be honest with you. You see a pitcher step off, you step out. Regular baseball. Just a hard, that's on the umpires. It's all on the umpires. I don't know how four umpires missed that. Uh, I don't, I don't get it. Uh, Yarmus, I'll be honest with you, bro. I don't even remember the pitch because I was so mad by that. So maybe it was a ball. I think it was up in the zone. Maybe it was a ball. I wasn't even paying attention to that. I was just mad about what happened because that's something that four major league umpires should not miss. It's unbelievable that the whole crew missed it. So. That that's uh that's the type of shit you deal with in baseball now. It's absolutely wild. It's absolutely wild. Jonathan Alvarez is currently in the Audi Club. Jonathan, let us know what are they serving. Do they have the veal chop? Do they have the veal chop? Let me know, Jonathan. Let me know. Pitch from Luis Hill is a call strike. Zero and one. Battle will be Kevin Biggio, Ernie Clement on deck. Who the Yankees can't seem to get out. Outside, and the count is one and one. One and one. Daffy. What up, Daffy? The one, one. Swing and a miss. And the count is one and two. One and two. One, <laughs> Ernie Bonds. Pitch is, ooh, just misses. And the count is two and two. Come on, Luis. Quick outs, quick outs, quick outs. Quick outs here, my guy. In the dirt, not even close. And the count is three and two. Here's the thing to Glay. Look, he steps off. Come on now. Come on. That, that's, that's ridiculous, man. That is so ridiculous. They just showed the highlight again, so I had to react to it. That is such a bullshit call. Wow. Three and two now on Biggio. Pitch is hit on the ground. The first base feels, flips, got him, and there's one away. One out, nobody on. That'll bring up Ernie Clement. That'll bring up Ernie Clement. Hank! What's going on, Hank? How you doing, Grace Monroe? How you doing, Grace? JC, Daryl Smith. What's going on, my guys? How you doing, Scott Horwitt? How are you? How is everybody doing, baby? Pitch is inside, and the count is 1-0 and o on Ernie Clement. Ernie Clement. We got a super chat. Can you 
from my brother Ronnie. Count is one and one. DJ Steels is tuning in from a lifetime. <laughs> oh, man. The pitch is outside three and one. He said DJ Steels is tuning in from a lifetime all-you-can-eat buffet. My God, these two, man. They love each other, by the way. Let me tell you something, guys. These guys love each other. DJ Steele says Ronnie's tuning in from the Mayflower. Oh, my God. Pitch. Call strike. And the beef is back. And the beef is back. The 3-2. Hey, struck him out, and there's two away. And there's two away. As you guys know, look, I'm all decked out in 4Q today. 4Q, 4Q, and of course, 4Q, baby. Guys, go and get your 4Q coffee. Go and get your 4Q coffee. Use the promo code NYYU. The 01 incoming to Dalton Varsho. Pitch is away. And the count is one and one. Ronnie's already getting some W's for the day. Damn. Ronnie's getting quick W's out the gate. Hey, he might win that one, man. He might win today. He might win today. That was tough. One and two. That was tough. I mean, that, that, I'll be honest with you. The reason I laughed so hard at that, it just caught me out of nowhere. I mean, it was just like a super elbow drop out of nowhere. Popped up. Who's it going to be? It'll be caught. And that'll end the inning. That's what I'm talking about, baby. Go to the bottom of the second. Yankees coming on up. Oh, look at that. Connor O'Neill says, brought some 4Q to a local firehouse today. Let's go. That's what's up, Connor. That's what's up, Connor. As you guys know, um, the owner of 4Q, Scott, is a firefighter. So, pretty damn awesome. Pretty damn awesome. JC now returns it and says, DJ Steels needs some W's. Look, man, I go based off what you guys say. If you guys don't pick, I go ahead and do it. So we got people going back and forth now trying to decide. <laughs> Ronnie says, that's all I got back to the game. All right. Ronnie went ahead and landed maybe a knockout blow, and that's it. I'm just saying. I'm just saying. Bottom of the second coming up, it'll be four, five, and six. Rizzo, Stanton, and Doogie coming up, guys. I'll be honest with you, man. I got to go ahead and see. Um... Doogie bat with those yellow cleats. I don't know, man. It gives me that stupid ass Red Sox vibe when they had those yellow outfits. It gives me that vibe, and I look at it and I go, how do they let him on the field with those shits? Like, I don't know. I gotta see it again. Ronnie getting some more W's, man. I'm just saying, Ronnie's getting some more W's. I'm just. Hey, look, man. I listen to the it's like the 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 Roman Emperors. Right now, Ronnie's getting these. That's all I'm saying. That's all I'm saying. Chris says support NYFD 100%. 100%. And guys, we got a big announcement coming up actually after 420, maybe on 420. We might have an announcement coming up um, regarding something that we are doing later in the season. So stay tuned for that. David, my guy with the super chat. Thank you for being a friend. Stanton gonna homer. Soto to go Yankees. I like it, baby. I like it a lot. I like it a lot. Here is Anthony Rizzo. The pitch. Swing and a miss. Got a super chat from Steels. Here we go. Ronnie's getting a lot of double. Nothing's going to ever keep you down. Ronnie getting a shit ton of W's. Let's see what Steele says. Pitch. Fouled away. I bet when Ronnie holds a drink, people confuse him for a margarita with fruit on it. Nah, I love my boy Ronnie. It's all love. Every, DJ Steals, everybody look, just so everybody's aware. It's all love with these guys, just so everybody's aware. It's all love with all of us here, baby. 
than all of us here, baby. Count is 0-2. The pitch. Outside 1-2. and Got a super chat from Connor O'Neill. Be careful. New York Air Force tons is taking off tonight. Might be another earthquake trying to get the plane off the ground. Pete, did you get your Rodon hat yet? No, I did not. It'll probably be coming earlier this week. It'll probably be coming earlier this week. Early this week, I should say. And that one hits him. So Anthony Rizzo will be on at first as he gets hit by the pitch. With the count being one and two. You never want that to happen. You never want that to happen, but indeed it did. But indeed it did. You're the best around. Nothing's ever going to keep you down. You're the best around. Here's G. The pitch. Right down to Johnson. 0-1. Smack you to likey. Hit you to something. Smack you to likey. Hitty your sister sub sub. Me likey. Oh, you bet your ass I likey. The 0 1 incoming to G. Did he go? E no. Count is 1 1. Scotty Horwitz. My private plane is ready to fly to NY for the 20th. His private plane, baby Scott. I like your style. Pitch is low. And the count is two and one. Two and one. Okay? Two and one. Okay? The pitch from Francis. He will step off, and this time they call it. Okay? He stepped off, all right? Dom Davis. The save situation. Hank, look at my guy, Hank, man. Come on now. Look at my guy, Hank. The 2 1 and coming to G. Great game yesterday. Can he continue it? And he has a swing like that. <laughs> Maybe he'll get a hit here. Count is 2 and 2 on G. I tell you, man. I tell you. Pitch outside three and two. I likey what I see. See, paid the cost to be the boss. Irish Rover says, Ronnie, thank you for supporting the NYFD New York Fire Department. I don't know, was that Ronnie or was that Connor O'Neill? It was, uh, I think it might have been Connor O'Neill, but anyway, anybody who supports it, we love you. Hey, struck him out. And there's one away. And there's one away. Um, Yankees Kyle, you actually shared this on our Discord channel. So we don't need to do that. <laughs> this one popped up from Doogie. And the guy shared it on my Discord page. You shared it on our Discord page. And you don't have to do that. But uh, there's two away. <laughs> and that will bring up Anthony Volpe. I'm just saying. I mean, I shared it on my Discord page just so everybody's aware. You shared it on our page. Yeah. <laughs> DJ Steels. DJ Steels an ass. DJ Steels gives him W's for that. You gotta be kidding me. The pitch is a call strike. Right now, Ronnie's in the lead. It's not close. Ronnie got about seven or eight uh W's already, so I'm just saying. Ronnie's in the lead right now. He's definitely in the lead right now. All right. The 0-1 incoming from Francis pitch. Taking his sweet-ass time. Pitch is swing and a miss. Damn. And the count is 0 and 2. You're the best around. Nothing's gonna ever keep you down. You're the best. West Coast Yankees fan says Stanton is so hit and miss. That's who he is. 
That's who he is. 0-2. Fouled away. And the count remains 0-2. Steele's getting some W votes, okay? Going a little back and forth action today. Little back and forth today. Count is 0-2 on Anthony Volpe. On deck is Austin Wells. Two outs, runner on first. Pitch is low. Did he go? No, he did not. The count is 1-2. and two. <laughs> He's more missed than hit. That's a good way of putting it. That is indeed a good way of putting it right now. He is definitely more missed than hit. I agree with that 100%. 100%. 39 likes away from 200. Pitch to Volpe, hit on the ground softly right back to the pitcher, Francis. He makes the play, and that will end the inning. We will go to the top of the third inning. We have a nothing, nothing ball game. Ronnie throwing some W's up for himself. I mean, you're allowed to do that. You can vote for yourself. Just saying. So that's additional W's for Ronnie. Okay. Additional W's there for Ronnie, all right? Smack you to like, folks. Hitty the sub. We appreciate you guys. I didn't talk about our sub goal today. Um, Let me see. 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 One second. 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 Where are we? Right here. We are at 24,326. Let's shoot for 24,350. That's 24 subbies away. I think we could do that today on a Sunday. I think we, we we had great numbers yesterday for being WrestleMania, by the way. So, um, you know, I think it just talks about the growth of NYYU right now. So, got to thank everybody, like I always do, for the continued support that you guys give us here at NYYU. Truly amazing. Why do scrubs become Cy Youngs when they face the Yankees? I don't know. It does happen often, doesn't it? It does feel like it happens often. Yeah, phantom outsider, that's not what I'm talking about. <laughs> I'm, not, I'm not talking about getting base hits. I'm talking about touching the baseball. That's what I'm talking about. I'm talking about touching the baseball. I'm not talking about getting base hits. When it comes to Stan, I'm talking about him even making contact. He's more miss than hit when it comes to hitting a baseball. That's what I'm not talking about singles, base hits. I'm not talking about any of that. At all. Ronnie says, Eric, this battle's been going on for like a year. It has been. This battle, I can confirm. Anybody that has been here, this battle has been going on for a little while. Okay? It's been going on for quite some time. Quite some time. It's probably been about, yeah, about, I think Steels might be right. Maybe closer to two years. It might be closer to two years, to be honest. The pitch to our good friend Isaiah Kiner Falefa is a call strike. And the count is 0 and 1. The 0 1 and coming from Luis Hill. Pitch, call strike, 0 and 2. Come on, baby. <laughs> That's my hill. And there's one away. And there's one away. 24 subbies from today's goal. Let's keep it going, baby. Here's Kevin Kiermeyer hitting 095 on the season. The 1 0 and coming from Hill. Pitch, swing, and a miss. Swingy and a missy. Swingy and a missy. Okay? A little swing and a miss action. The one, two. Hey! Struck him the fuck out. Two, hey! Oh, that's my hill. Electric stuff is what Luis Hill has, baby. Two away. 
That'll bring up Georgie Boy Springer. Pitches inside. One and O. Oh. One and O. Oh. One and O oh on George Springer line. Base hit the right field. I tell you what. Boy, I tell you what. If Springer played every game against the Yankees, I almost feel like this dude will hit 400. He beats the shit out of the Yankees. Let's be honest here, folks. He does. He kicks off fucking ass. Every time we face these guys, man, I'm telling you, man. I'm telling you. Chris, if the Yankees are struggling... Stop, bro. Stop, bro. Come on, man. What are we... Well, why why are we talking about trading Soto when the New York Yankees are seven and two? Why are we talking about trading Soto? Like I don't get where some fans even come from on this stuff. I don't. I really don't understand it. I'm not coming at you. Hit on a ground foul, but like, where do we get this stuff in our mind that the New York Yankees have started seven and two? There's a lot of great stuff going on for this club. And we're talking about trading Soto? I don't I don't get it, man. I don't get it. The 1-1 one, one is up. And the count is 2 and 1. 2 and 1. JC, just keep on loving me. Pitch. It hit him. It hit him. Oh, there's going to be a fight. DJ Steels versus Ronnie, WrestleMania 41. Sign me up. Sign me up. Sign me up for that one. There's going to be a brawl today. And they're going to come out and check on Vladdy. Pada, 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 pada. DJ Steele says, will Luis Hill be the real deal like Veal or will Hill be as disappointing as a Happy Meal? Hey, I like it. By the way, you doing a live for tonight, WrestleMania, bro? No, I just want to enjoy it. I'm going to enjoy it. I got designated spitters at 8 p.m. that I'm going to enjoy WrestleMania. Oh, yeah. Trade Soto and Judge and build around Volpe and Jason. How do you go from such a good super chat to such a bad super chat? I don't I don't understand. I, I don't understand, man. I don't get it. I don't get it. First and second now. So after two quick punch outs... Here's Bichette with first and second, two away. Pitch, way outside, and the count is one and oh. One and oh. 51 pitches for Luis Hill. Would like to just get out of this inning, and here comes a mound visit. Here's the good old mound visit time, folks. First and second, two away. <clears throat> Luis Hill with two very quick outs, a base hit, a hit by pitch. And now you're concerned about the Blue Jays possibly taking a lead here. That's not what you want to see. That's not what you want to see. Not at all what you want to see. Not at all what you want to see. So here we go. The 1-0 incoming to Bichette. Pitch. Fouled away. 97 down to Johnson. And the count is 1-1. One and one. Second outing of the year for Luis Hill. Could have had the victory if Aaron Boo let him go to one more batter last time out. But I digress. I digress. 1-1. One, one, up and in. And the count is 2-1. Two 2-1. And one. Two and one. The 2-1. Two one. Check swing, call the strike, two and two, let's go. Come on, baby. Strike out the side, you son of a bitch. Two, two. The 
two two. Pitch. Outside just misses. And the count is three and two. Three and two. Three and two. The three, two. Come on, Luis. He walked them. And the bases will be loaded for Alejandro Kirk. Alejandro Kirk. My God almighty. Bases loaded after two nice Ks. This is how you get taken out of games early. First pitch in the dirt. Good block. Bases loaded. 1-0. Bases loaded. 1-0. This is the shit that pisses you off, man. <sighs> Pitch. Two and oh. Two and oh. And his trouble. Anthony Rizzo coming out now to talk to him. Yeah, Medina, it's not about him nibbling. He doesn't have great command, and that's always been his problem. Especially, you know, that's the thing. It's not, I don't think that is he's, he's trying to nibble. He just, he's out of rhythm right now. The one thing about him is repeating his mechanics. That becomes a problem for a lot of pitchers. And Luis Hill's a guy that if something slightly goes off, he becomes extremely wild. Angel Hernandez now going out. What is he doing? I can't tell because the Yes Network is just showing Dom Mattingly. I don't know what the frig's going on. All right, now we're set again. The count is 2 and 0 oh on Alejandro Kirk. The 2 0. Oh. 3 and 0. Oh. I don't know why you go change up 2 0. Oh. Gotta let him put the ball in play. Why are you throwing a change up 2 0? Oh? It's early in the game. Challenge him. 3-0 incoming. Now, I don't know what the hell again. I, what, what the fuck is Angel Hernandez doing? Get behind the catcher, you scumbag. 3-0. Pitch. He walked them. And the bases are still loaded. one nothing Jays. This inning started with two strikeouts. This inning started with two strikeouts. It is now a one nothing game. First pitch is outside, 1-0. and oh. Here's Kevin Biggio. The 1-0 oh and coming from Luis Hill. Doesn't get the call there. To me, that's a strike. The count is 2-0. and 2-0 and on Biggio. As a call strike. Oh! As a call strike. The 2-1 incoming pitch. Outside, 3-1. And they don't even have to swing right here. They don't even have to swing. Just let him let him go ahead and just uh do what he does. Pitch fouled away. And the count is three and two. Smacky to like, hitty to damn sub sub. <sighs> Pitch fouled away. We'll do it again. Three and two, bases loaded, two outs. Two outs, nobody on. And inning continues. He's at 66 pitches right now. Yankees pen is active. 
Yankees pen is active. I believe that is Jake Cousins warming up. 3-2. Hey! Struck him out. That'll end the inning. So Luis Hill does strike out the side. But man, oh man, did he make it very tough. We go to the bottom of the third inning. Yankees coming on up, and it will be nice to get a little bit of offense against Francis, who everybody, including their mother, has smacked around for the last year and a half. Hey, it's better than it's better than what it could have been. Put it that way. That feels like a lucky outcome. I agree with you. A bad enough dude, I'm right there with you, man. That feels like a, a pretty lucky outcome. I thought it was going to get a lot worse than that, to be honest. Seven likes away, six likes away from 200. Let's go, guys. Smack it that like, hitty that sub like you've never done so in your life. Like you've never done so in your life. Couple of program updates for everybody. Of course, the post game show will be right after this. Eight o'clock today. Designated Spitters is live. Myself and Francis Lee. Make sure you guys are tuning in for that. And that will be it on the agenda today for NYYU. Nothing else locked and loaded today. So I thank you, Susan. Patrick, what's up, my guy? What's up, Patrick? How you doing, man? How you doing? 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 Yeah, Ness. What's up, Ness? How you doing, brother? Corbin Dallas. Corbin Dallas, welcome to the U. Let's go, my guy. Welcome to the U, brother. We appreciate you. We appreciate you. First pitch to Austin Wells from Bowden Francis is a swing and a miss. And the count is 0 oh and 1. 0 oh and 1. 0 oh and 1. The 0 oh 1 is fouled away. And the count is 0 oh and 2. 0 oh and 2. The 0-2 in coming on Wells. Pitch from Francis. Hit in the air to left field down the line. That will stay in foul territory, and there's one away. And there's one away. That'll bring up Oswaldo Cabrera. Rose for you says, why are you like five seconds ahead of what the TV is showing? Because I'm the fucking man, baby. That's why. The pitch is high. And the count is 1-0 on Waldo Cabrera. Crackle Nuts. What's up, Crackle Nuts? How you doing, my guy? David Staples. What's up? How you doing? How you doing? one nothing Jay's lead thanks to a shit ton of walks. Pitch is outside. And the count is 2-0. 2-0. and 2-0. Two and oh. Two and oh. Smacky to smack smack. Hitty to sub sub. 3-0 and oh now on Waldo, and I'll take it. <laughs> Men on base, baby. Men on base for the top of the order. Why not? Let's get some men on base for the top of the order. The 3 0. Hi, he walked him. Oh, baby, walk on by. Pete, who is your all time favorite Yankee? Man, you know, I got to go with Jeet, man. I got to go with Jeet, man. I got to go with Derek Jeter, man. That's my guy. That is my guy, man. Jeet growing up to me was absolutely everything. Jeet was my guy, man. So you got you got to go with the one that you you love most, man. Jeet, Posada. 
Robbie Cano, Paul O'Neill, Bernie, I mean, Mo. All those guys were just legendary growing up, man. So it, it's it's hard to go against any of those guys. Here is Glaber. Pitch is a call strike, and the count is 0-1. So a one-out walk here for the Yankees for the top of the order. Torres followed by Soto. Yankees down one to nothing. The 0-1. Swing and a miss. Quickly 0-2. Quickly, O oh, and two. <laughs> Hirsch always with the legendary one liners. Pitch outside, and the count is one and two. One and two. Crackle nuts with the super duper. Thank you for being a friend. Hey, we got a little uh, double one right there. Pitch is fouled away. We got a double. I was all right. Maybe every now and then we'll mix them up. Uh, Crackle nuts says, I can't wait to see Cody Rhodes cry with his crybabies tonight. Acknowledge the tribal chief. I think tonight WrestleMania is going to be fire. I hope so. I'm going to be watching it tonight, but I disagree with you. I think all signs point to Cody Rhodes winning tonight. The legends are going to help him win. That's what I see happening. Pitch. Oh, my God. He called that a strike. <laughs> oh, my God. One away. I tell you what, man. If I was a manager, there is no fucking way. If I was a manager, I could never manage a game with this guy umpiring because I swear to God, I clothesline his fucking ass. I'd hit him with the best lariat you've ever seen in your lifetime. Better than stand a man, Henson. Better than stand a man, Henson. I'd give him a clothesline that you've never seen before in your life. Maybe a straight up Bill Goldberg spear out of nowhere. Here's Soto and the count is 0-1. <sighs> Pitch. Hi. Runner throw, snap throw. And Vladdy's big ass falls over him. Vladdy's big ass falls over Oswaldo. And there's an earthquake in Jersey. Oh, there's an earthquake in Jersey, folks. Vladdy's big ass just shook the planet. And just like that, the count is one and one. The one one and coming to Soto. Pitch. Inside, and the count is two and one. Two and one. <laughs> the two one incoming pitch is fouled away. Fouled away. And the count is two and two on Soda. That one fouled off his foot. <clears throat> Excuse me. Little sloppy, uh, sloppy Vladdy action, okay? Two outs, runner on first base. The count is two and two. Two and two. The pitch from Francis. Hit in the air to right field down the line. There's a base hit. Cut off and right. Fires it in. It will be first and third as Soto gets a base hit to right. Sign the contract, big boy. Sign the contract. That'll bring up the captain, Aaron Judge. So the Yankees have a chance to tie it up and or take the lead. Here in the bottom of the third. <clears throat> Yankees have a chance to tie it up or take the lead. Two outs, runners on the corner for Aaron Judge. First pitch of the AB to Judge. Pitch. Inside almost hits him, and the count is one and oh. 
This will be pitch number 55 of the game for Bowden Francis. Crackle nuts. Pitch the judge is outside, and the count is 2-0. Pete, don't cry when rain smashes, Cody. I'm going to hold up the ones tonight. I'm the tribal chief, left-hand man. They call me mid-card crackle. <laughs> mid-card crackle. All right, man. We'll see you tonight, crackle nuts, but I know where you are. I know you're in the Discord server. Pitch is outside, 3-0. Crackle Nuts, I know you're dwelling in that Discord, my guy. So when Cody raises his hand and the story is completed, I will go ahead and let you know tonight that the story is indeed complete. When you hear that Stone Cold Steve Austin music drop out, he walked him. Whoops, wrong song. Oh, baby. Walk on by. Pum, 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 pum. But a but um bum, but um but um but um but um but um. All right, folks. First, and base is loaded for Anthony. 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 Come on, baby. Don't worry, Crackle Nuts. I know you're in that Discord server, my guy. When Cody Rhodes wins tonight and The Rock gets a Stone Cold Stunner, I'm telling you, man. I'm telling you, my guy. Pete, do you use a Go XLR? Um, I do have a microphone that's an XLR. I don't know what a Go XLR is. I'm not sure what that is. But I do have a mic that's connected to the that's an XLR mic. The pitch, low one and oh, baby. Can we get loud in here? <laughs> oh, I said, can we get loud in here, baby? I want to see the chat go nuts. Come on, baby. Let's go. The one oh incoming pitch calls it a strike low in the zone, and the count is one and one. One and one. One and one. Smacky to likey. Hit it a subby. Swing and a miss. One and two. Come on, Anthony. Come on, Anthony. Me likey. Oh, you bet your ass I do. Pete, with your permission, if Rizzo hits a gran a granny here. I'm singing a Rizzo song in the Audi Club. Get it, my guy. Get it. Two and two. Two and two. <laughs> oh, I want the lead here, baby. I want the lead like you can't imagine. The two-two pitch. Foul. Wait. <laughs> I was going in for that one, guys. I was going in for that one. Fouled away. And the count is two and two. Two and two. The two-two down the line. Foul ball. Fouls it right down the line. And the count remains Two and two. Two and two. Got a nice pitch to hit. That's a curveball that just stays up. Rizzo well out in front of it, unfortunately. We will do the 2-2 two -two yet again. 2-2 two -two from Francis. The pitch. High three and two. That will release the runners on the pitch. A ball in the gap could very well score everybody. A base hit guarantees you two. A walk will tie it. Timeout. <clears throat> Francis steps off. Three and two on Tony Rizzo. Big moment in this game. 
And Rizzo takes a timeout. So we will wait. Here we go. Rizzo steps in. The 3-2 pitch. Outside, he walks him. Yankees tied up. Oh, that's my Rizzo. We got a tie game at one. Great at bat by Anthony Rizzo, Tony Riz. Oh, baby, walk on by. And here's Stanton with the bases loaded. Call strike. The count is 0-1. Stanton doesn't like the call. It's up and in. He didn't like it. I thought it was a bit high myself. But the count is 0-1. Stanton had his best game in a long time yesterday. The pitch fouled away, and the count is quickly 0 oh, and 2. Come on, baby. Come on, G. Come on, G. Keep it going, baby. Keep it going. The 0 oh, 2. Pitch. High. Paid the call to be the boss. Bada, 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 bada. Crackle nuts, give me one second. Let me see this pitch, my guy. Let me see this pitch. Count is one and two on G. Pitch. Doesn't go two and two. Also, anyone who's a member joined the Discord, so when Reigns wins, we can let Pete know I'm going to be on the left side of my tribal chief. I'll hand him the belt. Mid-card crackle will stop Stone Cold. You nuts, bro. <laughs> Mid-card crackle. That's your new name for now on. Mid-card crackle. The 2-2. Two -two. Hit in the air. Popped up. Over is Vladdy. It'll go foul. We'll do the 2-2 two -two again. Smacky to likey. Hitty the subby. If you have not. We got over 600 in here right now. Come on, guys. Smack the like. Hit the sub. 23 subbies away from today's goal. Let's get there, baby. Let's get there. We will do the 2-2 again. Coming to the set is Francis. The pitch. Hit in the end of left field and deep. Going back. Oh! That's my Stanton. And holy shit. Did Stanton hit the G spot? And the Yankees take a five to nothing lead. Oh, G might just be hot. Who knows? I guess I got to make more videos saying he's bad. Just like that, Stanton absolutely obliterates it. Obliterates it. And it is a 5-1 to one Yankee lead. Look at Big G. Look at G. Here's Doogie. Fouls the first pitch away, and the count is 0-1. Oh, and one. Pitch is low, and the count is one and one. One and one on Doogie. Pitch. Swing and a miss. And the count is one and two. Huge inning for the New York Yankees. Huge inning. An inning they desperately needed. Yankees desperately needed this type of inning. Giving Luis Hill a nice break. Timeout called by Doogie. He will step back in. Pitch. Inside and the count is two and two. Two and two. Two and two. 
2-2. Right down the Johnson fouled away. Thank you for being a friend. But uh but um. Rod Tom says, Pete, you never doubted Stanton one bit. I will testify in a stand for you. I still doubt Stan. I'm not, I'm not coming off of what I've said. Pitch is hit on the ground softly. Flips over, got him. That'll end the inning. I know Stanton got power. Everybody knows that. That's nothing new. Everybody knows Stanton got power. The fact of the matter is, can he do it over an extended period of time? That's the question for G. It's never about Kenny Homer. Would anybody doubt that if Stanton plays the whole season, he'll hit 30 homers? But is he going to hit 220? That's the question. That's what I'm looking for. I need consistency. We got another super chat from Crack These Nuts. Crackle Nuts says, you got the right-hand man, Jey Uso. Also main event, Jay. So I'm the left-hand man. Mid-card Crackle will stop Cena, Stone Cold, Hulk Hogan. Maybe I'll sweet chin music them. Who you got, Rollins or Drew? I think Drew McIntyre is also going to get it done tonight. Kerry Bartley, Soto, Judge, Rizzo, and Stanton scores first time. Great point. I didn't even think about that. I didn't even think about that. That is a great point. All three of those big guys score. I love it, baby. I love it. David says, come on, Pete. We will all look the other way. We love you. What did I do? What did I do? What did I do? Look the other way for what? What do we do? What are we talking about here? Drew wins and drops to Gunther in Germany. I can see that, Hank. I can see that. That makes a lot of sense. That makes a lot of sense. That makes a shit ton of sense, baby. <laughs> Harsh. Crackle nuts. Don't be getting in trouble with your mother, all right? Don't be getting in trouble with your mother, okay? Yeah, I, I think that's, the, that's what they're going to play when it comes to Rollins is that the leg is so beat up. He ain't going to be able to, to pull out that victory today. So it's going to go to Drew is what I think is going to happen. That's what I got happening tonight. Two and two. I mean, excuse me, 22. 22 subbies away from today's goal. Let's go, baby. Let's go, baby. Let's go. All right. Luis Hill now has a four-run lead. And this is what I would do, right? I'd go out there. I'd talk to Luis Hill before he went out. And i say, look, Luis, honestly, brother, you got a four-run lead. Pump fastballs to these guys, man. Let Make them hit the ball. Make them hit the ball and put the ball in play. Make them hit the ball and put the ball in play. Swing and a miss. And the count is 0-2 on Ernie Clement. 0-2 Oh, and two on Ernie Clement. Mike Bragg, what's up, my guy? Hey, struck him out. And there's one away. And there's one away. Louise Hill, three and one third innings, six strikeouts so far. Oh, we know he can do that. He just got to have himself a nice quick inning here so he can be in line for the win. There's a call strike, 0 and 1. That's what you got to do. Giovanni, what's up, my brother? How you doing, fam fam? How you doing? How you doing? How you doing? How you doing? Pitch is outside. And the count is 1 and 1. Patrick, what's up, my guy? Alexis, how you doing? Pitch. Call strike 1 and 2. Come on, baby, put him away quick. Sassy Queenie Sweetie. What's going on, Sassy Queenie Sweetie? Oh, hey. Coach, very happy to hear that, my guy. Very happy to hear that. Foul ball count remains one and two. Count remains one and two. One and two. Count remains one and two. Pitch fouled away. And the count remains one and two. Put him away quick, Luis. Put him away quick. Put him away quick. High. Two and two. Don't get crazy here now. I 
Outside, three and two. Three and two. Fastball down the friggin' Johnson, Luis. Fastball down the Johnson. Fouled away. Do it again. You got a four-run lead. Don't give them opportunities by walking, guys. Throw them a fastball down the Johnson. And he walked them. Damn, man, the friggin' walks with this guy. Chef Nick says, from Brooklyn and why the chef loves your channel. And I keep following every time you post. Much respect to you and your fam at NYY Underground. Chef, we appreciate you, brother. Thank you so much, man. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Well, Jocko, Yes Network, they're the Yankees Network. They got to try to hype up Stanton as much as he can. They got to they gotta hype up Stanton as much as, he, as they can while they can. The 0-1 is a swing and a miss, and the count is 0-2. Pitch number 82 coming up to IKF. He struck out on three pitches his last A-B. He's down 0-2 here. The 0-2. Foul the way, just got a piece of it upstairs. Top of the fourth inning, Luis Hill sitting at 82 pitches right now. There's a chance he may not make it through the fifth again. There's a chance he may not make it through the fifth again. As the 0-2, hey, struck him out. Fastball down to Johnson. Yeah, guys, the Yes Network's going to do that. They got to hype up G as much as they can. They got to try to hype up Stanton as much as they can, folks. And I don't blame them. If I'm paying them that much money, I'm going to try to hype them up too. Count is 1-0. Kevin Kiermeyer's the batter here in the top of the fourth inning. Pitch number 85 about to be delivered from Luis Hill. Yankees up 5-1. to one. Low. And the count is 2 and 0. Oh. 2 and 0. Oh. Two, and oh. 2 and 0. Oh. 2-0 and coming. Swing and a miss. 2 and 1. 2 and 1. Come on, Luis, you son of a bitch. Paulo Espino warming up for the Toronto Blue Jays. Pitch low. Three and one. Here we go again. <clears throat> Here we go again. No, you're not boosting Stanton's trade value at all. Not at all. Not at all. This one fouled away, and the count is three and two. Got to put him away here. Got to put him away here. Pitch fouled away, in on his hands, and the count remains three and two. Gotta put him away here, baby. Gotta put him away here. Yankees up 5-1. to one. Luis Hill looking to get out of the fourth. Ah, 3-2. Hey! Struck him the fuck out! Hey! Struck him out! That's my hill. That's my hill, baby. Big strikeout right there for Louis Hill, okay? If you didn't know, now you know. If you didn't know, now you know, okay? Okay? Give me one second, guys. Give me one second. Let me clean this mess up right over here. 
clean this mess up right over a Yankees I have 789 coming up Volpe Wells and Waldo coming on up for us the Yankees what's up everybody how you guys doing how you doing everybody how you doing everybody how you doing Hill walks down Electric Avenue more than Eddie Grant I tell you what man there ain't many people out there like Hirsch There are many coffees like 4Q. There are many coffees like 4Q. You understand what I'm telling you? 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 There ain't many coffees like a little 4Q action, baby. I tell you right now. I tell you right now. Polo Espino coming in the game. He'll face 7, 8, and 9. Again, Volpe. Wells and Waldo, okay? Volpe, Wells, and Waldo, okay? Let's switch on back on over to as another boy. And folks, look at that. We are 19 subbies away from today's goal. You guys are literally the best. I say it all the time. There is nobody. There is nobody like the NYYU community. No body, baby. Okay? Here is Paulo Espino. This season in AAA, one game. Okay. Not a lot of action. First pitch is outside, and the count is 1-0. Oh. 1-0. and oh. The pitch outside. Ooh, calls it a strike. And the count is 1-1. One and one. You could tell Anthony Volpe hates Angel Hernandez. Then again, I think just about everybody does. I think just about every player can't stomach this guy. One and two, Volpe looked at him and said, I hate your guts. <laughs> the one, two from Espino. Pitch. Fouled away. And the count remains one and two. And not only are you a hot dog, a grandstander, a showboat, and a prima donna, but you're a liar too. Five to one, Yankees lead. They look to extend that lead and win this series. Oh, one, two. Hit on the ground. Base hit the right field. That's that two strike approach, baby. Look at that two strike approach. I don't got to hit it out to right field. I just got to pop it over there. I just got to pop it over there. I love it, baby. I love it. I love it. <clears throat> I love it, baby. I love it. I love it. <clears throat> the pitch. Call strike on the corner, and the count is 0 oh and 1. 0 oh and 1. <clears throat> hey, Joe, maybe we'll start promoting your mother on here. How about, how about that? How do you like that? How do you like that? If you don't like the coffee, you don't got to like the coffee. Don't tell us what to do. If you want to open another, I'll open a prostitution business up. We'll start promoting your mother on here. How's that? That's what we'll do, buddy. Just for you. We're going to name it just for you, my guy. All right? Special. Special for you, baby. Pick off attempt at first. And the count is one. And one. <laughs> Yankees up 5-1, to one, the 1-1 one, one incoming to Wells. The pitch, pickoff attempt. Good time for Volpe to look to run here. Why the hell not? Why the hell not, baby? The 1-1 one, one to Wells. Pitch in the dirt, 2-1. Come on, baby, you smacky that like. 
You hitty that subby like you've never done so in your life, baby. Oh, you do it. You do it, baby. A 2-1. Outside, and the count is 3 and 1. 3 and 1. 3 and 1. A 3-1 incoming. Runner goes. Throw. Hit in the end of left field. Ranging back. On the track, the catch will be made. And there's one away. Volpe would have had that base stolen by a mile. But, 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 but. But I do not get upset with Austin Wells because he put a very, very good swing on that one. He put a very good swing on that one. Did he step on a bag? I guess he stepped on a bag when he came back. So one away now. That'll bring up Waldo Cabrera. That'll bring up good old Waldo. Mm, excuse me. One out. Runner on first, one away. Runner on first, one away. The pitch to Cabrera. Hit on the ground. That could be two. There's one. They will not go to first. So Cabrera hustles it out there to stop it. So it'll be a runner on first base, two outs. And that'll bring up Glaber Torres. That'll bring up Glaber Torres. <laughs> <clears throat> so here is Glaber. Thank you, Macho. Thank you, Macho. I, I, you know, people crack me up. People crack me up. I mean, look, you know, you're supporting a company that does a lot of good things for first responders and this and that. And you want to act like, you know, you probably you haven't even tried it. You haven't done nothing. I know for a fact he hasn't bought it. I know that for a fact because I get a list of people who use our code. He hasn't bought it. So he just wants to be a jerk off and go ahead and talk shit about a company that is handled by first responders trying to do good things out there and that we support because, you know, bums got to be bums. Bums hate when people are trying good stuff. That's just what happened. That, that's a part of life. That's a part of life. That's what people do. He hasn't even bought the coffee. He hasn't even bought the coffee. I know for a fact, because again, I get a list of anybody who uses the promo code. So it is what it is. That's what people do. That, that's how, you know, and you know the sad thing? Guy's probably 45 years old. This is what I found out about YouTube. A lot, of, a lot of the trolls aren't younger people. It's older people. It's very sad. It really is. It's sad. It's honestly sad. I never would have expected that. If somebody told me, I got to be kids. Right? 15 years old, 20 years old. No, it's people over, old, um, over 40. It's, it's crazy. It really is crazy. Well, Steels, remember, I'm not welcome to North Carolina, so it is what it is. What are you going to do? What are you going to do? Five to one Yankees lead. The one, two to Glaber. Hit in the end of left field foul. And the count remains one and two. Yeah, Adrian, I think you probably got about another week or two weeks to go. Probably about two more weeks to go. Probably about two more weeks to go. <clears throat> the one-two incoming. The one-two to Glaber. In the dirt. And the count is two and two. Two and two. Speaking of that, hey, look, if you guys want to go ahead and taste that coffee that's terrible... Go ahead and grab your 4Q coffee. Get 10% off with the code NYYU. Always free shipping. There's the link right there, guys. Taste the deliciousness of 4Q. Forget what these, uh, what the jerk off who never even tasted it said because he wants to hate. Don't worry. We're going to open the website, the, the website for him alone. NYYUprostitutes.com. Coming soon. Hit in the end of right field. That'll dunk in for a base hit. It'll be first and third for Soto. So Glaber Torres with a solid AB just fights it off. And it dunks in for a base hit. Thank you for being a friend. 
Ra Ra, I appreciate you, brother. Thank you so much, man. Thank you so much, my guy. Thank you so much. Thank you, MMAC. I appreciate that, my brother. Thank you so much. Steels, we got a lot of these things coming, my guy. We got a lot of these things coming. A lot of them are coming, baby. What are you going to do? What are you going to do? Doreen. Well, here is Soto in a big moment again for the Yankees. Can they add on some more? Sign the contract, big boy. Sign the contract. <laughs> ah, hit on the ground softly. Flips the first. They'll get Soto. Soto does something he typically doesn't always do. He chases the first pitch. And he grounds out to end the inning. Guys, we will go to the top of the fifth inning. Blue Jays coming up. Give me a second, guys. I will be right back with you. Smacky that likey. Hitty that subby. All righty, folks, we are back in action. Luis Hill will start the top of the fifth inning. Let's hope, uh, you know, gets a couple of quick outs here, could get himself a victory. First pitch is inside. Let me get this off the screen. One second, guys. There we go. Oh, hey. Oh, uh, hey. It's Maggie Delight. Hit in the hobby. First pitch is, uh, where the hell am I? Hold on one second. My game went back to the first pitch again. Count is one and one. One and one on Georgie Boy Springer. Georgie Boy Springer pitch. Fouled away. And the count is one and two. <clears throat> pitch hit on the ground softly fields fires got him Glaber Torres with a bare hand on that one probably could have gloved it but decides to go with the bare hand and there's one away but he does make the play that's good I'll take it I'll take it baby smacky to like hitty to sub baby let's go let's go Luis Heal needs two outs to be in line for the win. He's at 94 pitches. Can he get it? Here's Vladdy. Liner, base hit, goes to the wall. Shit, that might do it. That might do it. Vladdy will stop at second with a one-out double. He's at 95 pitches now. I don't think they're going to make him go much over 100, if that. So... There's going to be a mound visit, and let's see. This probably is going to be it. I'm waiting. They got to keep showing Vladdy here. Come on, man. Who gives a shit about Vladdy, bro? I'm still waiting to see if it's going to be a pitching change, and it will be. Sign the contract. Oh, wrong one. <laughs> it's 
So again, huh, Luis Hill will not get a victory. But what are you going to do, man? It looks like Jake Cousins will now come into this ball game. Jake Cousins will now be in this ball game, guys. We are 15 subbies away from today's goal. Let's go. Let's keep getting there, baby. Come on now. Come on now. Let's keep getting there. Let's keep getting there, baby. Keep it going. 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 Keep them going. Let's hope Jake Cousins is on today. Last thing you want to see is the Yankees bullpen get knocked around here. That's the last thing you want to see. <clears throat> It'll be Bichette coming up with a runner on second base, one away. Ah, you know, I'll be honest with you guys, man. Um, I'll be honest with you guys, man. Uh, the thing with Luis Hill today, I'm not mad with Boone. I I'm not mad with Aaron Boone today. I mean, look, Luis Hill put himself in a lot of trouble today. He put himself in a lot of trouble. So, for the game today, I'm not overly upset. I think at the end of the day, if he got Vladdy right there, of course you leave him for one more batter. But if somebody got on, I'm not upset with Aaron Boone for pulling them right here. I'm, I'm just not. Luis Hill put himself in a lot of tough situations today, but he gave the Yankees the chance to win. He's leaving his game. They're up by four runs. So, I mean, all I'm saying is I don't necessarily like that he doesn't get the victory, but he did what he needed to do. He did what he needed to do. And I'm right there with you, Seiko. He, you know, he was at 95 pitches with stressful innings. No way he stays in. I agree. The walks the walks were excessive today. First pitch is a beautiful slider, and the count is 0-1 on Bo Bichette. 0-1 on Bo Bichette. The 0-1 incoming. We are 14 subbies away from today's goal pitch. Hit in the air to right field. Running back, still back, over everybody's head. And just like that, it's a 5-2 game. Here comes the Yankees' bullpen. You know, Jay Cousins got a good slider, but you just can't keep throwing it. As a matter of fact, I'm wrong. That was a fastball. That was a fastball that was just laced to right field. And that's back-to-back -back doubles. That run goes to Luis Hill. And it's a 5-2 to two game. Only one out here. This one could get very close very quick. First pitch is you guessed it, a slider. And the count is 1-0. Oh. King, King Solomon, what's up, my guy? How you doing? How you doing? This pen has more holes than a leaking pipe. Well, it got work to do, no doubt about it. There's a strike. On, you guessed it, a slider. On a slider. Yeah, you know what I think it is with the bullpen? I think the Yankees towards, you know, middle of the season, they kind of figure it out. Um, early in the year sometimes is like this. And another slider outside, and the count is two and two. But um, they do this often. It's like they 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 wait till they find the right mix. And then they get that right mix and they're they're pretty good. So let's let's hope that's gonna be the case. Count is two and one. They got it two and two on the screen that I'm looking at, but it's it's actually two and one on Alejandro Kirk. No, you couldn't have left Luis Hill out there. There was there it, it, it wouldn't be smart to leave Luis Hill out there in that situation. Pitches outside, slider again. And the count is three and one. You are up by three runs right now. Why is every single pitch a slider that nobody's swinging at? Throw a friggin' fastball. Call strike. And the count is three and two. Second half of the season, the Yankees should have multiple relievers back. Canely should be back sooner than everybody. Did he go? No, he didn't. He walked them. First and second tying run coming to the plate. Yankees are expected to get Canely back, Scott Efros, 
Um, um, Lou Trevino, JT Brubaker. So they're expected to get quite a few guys back, and that's not including all the guys they have in the minor leagues. Two guys in double A, three guys in double A, Velasquez, Neely, and Danny Watson. Those are three guys to look out for. So I do think the Yankees will have the right bullpen at some point, but right now it doesn't look good. Pitches high and it gets away. No runner will advance. It will be first and second. One out. First and second. One out. First and second. One out. <clears throat> the 1 0 and coming from Cousins. Pitch. Low, and it's 2-0. and 2-0. and Here we go. Here we go, folks. The 2-0 pitch. Call the strike. 2-1. and 2-1. One. Two and one. As a strike, two and two. Come on, get him, baby. Come on. Come on. Come on, come on, come on. Put his ass away. Put his ass away. Just go to a fastball slider outside. And the count is three and two. Just go to the fastball. You throw 96. Bro, you throw 96. Challenge these guys. Let them do damage if need be, but let your defense play. The 3 2 pitch. Hit in the air to center field, not deep. It's actually popped up. Volpe's going to call for it. He makes the catch, two away. Big out. That's a big out right there, folks. That is a big out right there, no doubt about it. That is a big out right there in that situation. That is a big out. So two outs, <clears throat> first and second, five to two game. Here's Ernie Clement. Pitch from Cousins, swing and a miss, and the count is O oh and one, O oh and one. Hanton Valdez, what's going on? Faith Life Sports, how are you? The O oh one, outside, and the count is one and one. One and one on Ernie Clement. One and one. The one one. Popped up foul and the count's one and two. Let's go. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. Put him away. Put him away. Big moment right here. Yankees up by three, looking to keep it there. The one, two, doesn't chase. And the count is two and two. I think everybody knew a slider was coming there. Not terrible execution on it, but Ernie Clement does not chase. Clement likes, he chases high sometimes, I've noticed. Two, two, popped up. Austin Wells calling for it. He can't make the play. In and out of Austin Wells' glove. And that should be an error on Wells as he cannot make the play and get the Yankees out of this inning. So we, so Ernie Clement will get another chance. That is big. That is big. Austin Wells needs to learn due to Jorge Posada. When there's a pop-up, throw that mask somewhere. Get it off your face. Don't hold it. You don't hold the mask in your hand. 2-2 two, two incoming. Pitch. Fouled away. And the count remains 2-2. Two and two. 
Oh, Alexander Gordon, I love Wells. I'm not, I'm not knocking Wells. I'm just saying. When that ball is popped up, you got to do the Jorge and fling that mask away. So let's see if Cousins and the Yankees could pick up Austin Wells here. 5-2 game, the 2-2 pitch. Popped up. Right there is Judge. No damage done. That will end the inning. We go to the bottom of the fifth. It'll be Judge Rizzo Stanton coming on up. Well, the Yankees maintain a three-run lead. Cousins picks up his catcher. That's always good. And no additional damage done. No additional damage done. I got to refresh my MLB TV, guys. One second is doing this thing with me again. I hate when it does this. 84 likes from 400. Let's go, baby. We've had 500 plus in here the entire time. You guys are the best. You guys are the best. Three, four, and five do up for the Yanks. Dominic Davis says, let's get that run back and some. I agree 100%. Let's get all those damn runs back. Let's get all those runs back. Let's get all the runs we can back. Why the hell not? Why the hell not? We should have Stanton behind the plate. Come on, Luis. What are you doing, Luis? Come on, brother. Come on, brother. Come on, brother. Come on, brother. All right. <clears throat> Wait, you don't get in someone's face over an arrow? Did that actually happen? Am I missing something? Or are you just saying you don't do that? Okay, yeah, I know you definitely don't do that. Got here late. Why did he, why did he pull Hill? I uh, gave him a double. He was about at 95 pitches already. It, it was time to it was time to take him out of there. I don't disagree with Boone on that one. I don't disagree with Boone on that one. I'm sorry. Uh, Luis Hill, he he hurt himself today. Had nothing to do with Aaron Boone. He had some really bad innings where he just let a lot of guys on base with all the walks. I I don't I do not disagree with Aaron Boone on this one. Pitch the judge is hit in the air to center field. Stays up. Man, there's quickly one away. Quickly one away. So one out. That'll bring up Anthony Rizzo had that excellent at bat to walk and load the bases. Then Stanton hit the grand slam. That was the big moment of the game. That was a good move from Boone. Yeah, look, you guys know, I think of everybody who's watched me for a long time. Look, I'm going to call it how I see it. If it's, a, if it's good for Boone, I'll say it. If it's bad, I'll say it. Today wasn't bad, in my opinion. That one is low to count as 1-0. and I'm the first one to, to stick up for starters to get a W. But at the end of the day, Luis Hill damaged himself today. It wasn't on Aaron Boone. The 1-0. Call strike. And the count is 1-1. One and 1-1. One. One and one. Pitch is low. And the count is uh, two and one. Two and one. Two and one. Two one is outside. Three and one on Anthony Rizzo. Three and one on good old Tony Rizzo. Gunner, what's up, my guy? Yes, everybody is welcomed here. That one is high, and the count is uh, ball four. So Anthony Rizzo with the walk. Look, man, you guys, if you guys have not watched me for a long time, I, I joke. I joke around with a lot of people, even the guy where I said about his, about his mom. Obviously, everybody should know I don't mean that. We joke around here is what we do. You know, sometimes some people come here to hate and to be stupid. And you go at them. You know what I mean? I, I have no hatred or anger towards people who do stuff like that. It's just that's that's going to be with constant growth of a channel, of a company. That stuff's going to happen. Nobody, you know, that's just that's just what people are going to do. But everybody is welcome to NYYU to have a good time. 
It's that simple. A pitch is swung on and missed, and the count is 0-2. I'm not opening up a prostitution ring, folks. I promise you. <laughs> Believe it or not, I'm not opening up a prostitution ring, okay? I promise you. 0-2 on Stanton. Hit in the air to left field, down the line. Oh, nobody that's on the left fielder, bro. That's not, it's a foul ball, but that is not on Clement. That is on the left fielder. I believe that's Varsho. Who's in left field? That's Varsho. That's Varsho. That's Varsho's ball, man. Varsho has to catch that. Varsho has to catch that, man. He has to catch that. He has to catch that ball. He has to catch that ball, man. He has to catch that ball. My God. Patrick says, don't be soft. Patrick, there ain't no softness here, brother. There ain't no stay. There ain't an ounce of softness over here, my guy. Pitch is hit in the air again to left field. That's a foul ball. Pulled it, and the count remains 0 and 2. I mean, Dalton Varsho, well, that ball, poor Clement had to run all the way to where Dal where friggin' this dude is almost positioned. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. Man, he couldn't make the catch. I mean, that's just a that's a bad play on your left fielder. On Dalton Varsho, who really hasn't lived up to it. And he's a guy I liked a lot. I, I'll admit it. I was wrong on Varsho. I thought Varsho was going to be very good. He has not turned out to be too good at all for Toronto. They got to be upset about that deal because they gave up quite a bit. They gave him quite a bit. One and two on Stanton. The pitch from Espino. Pitch. Hit on the ground. The third. That could be two. There's one. As a DP. And that will end the inning. We will go to the top of the sixth. Toronto coming up. It's a three-run ball game, folks. It is a close game right now. It is a close game right now. It is a close game right now, folks. Yes, indeed. Yes, indeed. Smacky that like. Hitty that sub if you haven't, baby. Me like it. Oh, you bet your ass I like e, damn it. You bet your ass I like e. You bet your ass. <laughs> Ay, 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 I tell you guys. We go again to the top of the sixth inning. Just reminder, guys, around the seventh inning or so, start leaving your voicemails for the post-game show. We have that covered for you right after the game. And also tonight, designated spit is live at 8 p.m. Do not miss it. I'm sure me and Francis are going to have a lot to talk about for the start of the year. Uh, we didn't have a show last weekend, so I think we're going to have a shit ton to talk about. We're going to have a shit ton to talk about. Okay, let's see here. Okay. Little DP action there for Stanton. What are you going to do? It happens, folks. It happens. It happens every now and then, okay? All right, Jake Cousins back out for another inning of work. Let's hope this helps, or let's hope this works. Excuse me. Let's hope this works for Cousins. Let me close this out, guys. One second. There we go. Hit in the air to left field. Doogie makes the catch. He lost it for a second. He takes a big breather. So Doogie lost it in the sun. Sees it at the last second and is able to make the catch. So there's one away. <clears throat> uh, guys, look, I I'm not going to address anything. I I'll just look. I'll simply say this. I'll make this. I'll make this very, very simple. Um, I started doing a post game show, as you guys know, and my former designated spitters co-host blocked me after that because I started to do a post game show. So when we talk about weakness and we talk about um, absolute 
a losing mentality. That's all. I'm going to leave it at that. I got no interest in talking about anybody else. But I started to do a post-game show, and I got blocked. So if people want to follow along with that type of weakness, go right ahead. Go right ahead. God bless them. Pitch is outside, and the count is 2-1. and one. Aaron Rodgers, my guy. Thank you for being a friend. He said, next season, NYYU event in L.A. for us West Coast people to catch the Yankees versus Dodgers. That'll be tough. That's tough. That's tough, my guy. I don't know. We can, uh, we can maybe figure that out. Maybe we can figure that out. Three and one. Three and one on IKF. Three and one on IKF. The three one incoming pitch. In there for a call strike. And the count is three and two. Count is three and two. Scott, oh, no problem, my guy. Look, I never have an issue um, telling people the truth about things. When, when you have nothing to hide, the truth is very easy. And like I said, nothing could ever be said differently because I have all the receipts and the evidence. So it doesn't, it doesn't matter. People are just weak, bro. People are just weak. There's no competition. It's like people don't have an audience. Everybody has an audience. Pitches, blooped. Coming in as judge. It'll be a base hit. So that'll be a base hit off of the bat of IKF. That'll bring up Kevin Kiermeyer. That'll bring up Kiermeyer. And to be fair, I don't dislike, I'm, I'm just saying, I don't dislike the dude. I'm just saying, I'll leave it at that. I don't dislike the guy at all. I got no problem with the guy. I just sat there and said, hey, I'm doing a post-game show, and all of a sudden, I'm blocked and the entire team is blocked. <laughs> or is, is blocked in general. So, well, what are you, you, know, you going to do? What are you going to do, man? I can't control other people. I can't make people, like I said, like us. I can't make people feel a certain way. Again, guys, I'm, we're just, we, we focus on NYYU, and that is it. We don't focus on nobody else. We're focusing on what we're doing. The 1-0 is outside. The count is 2-0. Count is two and O. Oh. Nick Birdie warming up for the Yankees. Nick Birdie warming up for the Yankees. The 2 0 oh. outside in the count is three and O. Oh. Three and O. Oh. Three and O. Oh. The 3 0 oh incoming. And he walked them. Here we go again. Here we go again. Yankees bullpen looking to hand the game right back. First and second, one out. And a tying run will come to the plate. Tying run will come to the plate. Tying run comes to the plate. That'll bring up the top of the order in George Springer. Let's see if Boone is going to go ahead and go to Nick Birdie here. And I'm waiting to see if that is indeed Aaron Boone. It looks like it's a regular mound visit. I don't know yet. Who's coming out? Who's coming out? It'll just be a regular mound visit. There's no coach coming out. So Austin Wells will come out there and talk to Cousins. They might just be buying time. They may just be buying time here for Boone to come out afterwards. Let's see. Nah, Boone is getting comfy. I don't think that's the case. I don't think that's the, that's the case. I don't think that's the case. <clears throat> oh, I don't want to see that stupid-ass bullpen budget. I can't stand that damn thing. I can't stand that thing. Well, Cousins is going to stay in here to face George Springer. Nick Birdie is now going to come in, so he will not face him. Here comes Boone. Here comes Booney, and it will indeed be Nick Birdie against Springer and Vladdy. And let me say this real quick. I'm going to say this really, really quick. The Ace Avenue, my brother. How you doing, fam, fam? Let me say this real quick, guys. 
This is a really, really big moment in this game. Let me tell you why. This is also a really, really big moment for Birdie. Let me tell you why. Birdie is in a position here to really claim a spot for himself in this bullpen as somebody that can be trusted. If Birdie comes in here and gets out Springer and Vladdy, or maybe gets a quick double play, it's going to put him in that position to be one of the go-to guys for Boone and company this year. This is that first really, really big test. This is a really, really big test right here. This is a big test for Birdie. We'll see what happens. Hey, Scott, you know what I mean, brother? We don't always have to disagree. We don't always have to. We're not always going to agree with each other. But um, again, like I said, I always try to show as much respect as I can. And a lot of people, you know, sometimes people get New Yorkers' um, attitudes wrong. New Yorkers will say, man, you're stupid. And people find offense when it's like, that's a, that's a regular form of communication <laughs> for New Yorkers. He's calling me names. Nah, bro, I'm just talking. That's how I talk. This guy's acting like a bitch. I don't mean, I don't mean it bad. You know what I mean? We don't mean it bad necessarily, but, you know, we, we try our best. You're never going to make everybody happy. You're never going to make everybody happy, folks. You're never going to make everybody happy. Well, it, well, again, I don't want to stick on this, but my whole team never did anything to the guy, and I guess the whole team also got the same type of treatment. But, hey, look, again, fuck it. It is what it is. God bless him. I wish him well. Pitch is a call strike on the outside corner. That is a beautiful pitch. <laughs> Come on, baby. Count is 0 and 1 on Springer. The 0 1 incoming. The pitch. Outside 1 and 1. This is a big moment for Birdie. That's my guy. Nick Birdie is my guy, baby. Nick Birdie is my friggin' guy. Come on, Nick. You can do it, baby. The 1-1 one, one and coming to Springer. Pitch. Come on, come on. Way outside. That's not what you want to see. That's not what you want to see. Okay? <laughs> That's not it. That's not it. That's not it. That's not it. 2-1 and one now on Springer. First and second one away. The Pitch. In there for a call strike. Come on, chat. I need you guys loud, baby. Come on, come on, come on. Come on, baby. The 2-2 two -two pitch. Hit on the ground. It could be two. No, he bobbles it. Oh, no. No. It'll be the bases loaded, routine double play ball, guaranteed at least one out. Bobbled by Cabrera. That is a huge error. Trying to make the play without grabbing the baseball, man. Little league mistake right there. Little league mistake. Trying to make the play before you have possession of the ball. Little league error. Wasn't even hit hard. Guaranteed at least one out. Here's Vladdy, bases loaded. Pitches outside, 1-0. Forget it. Forget it. Forget it. Yeah, I think Cousins is sent down after this game. I think Cousins is definitely sent down after this game. Nick Birdie came in. He did his job immediately. Now it gets tough. Hit on the ground softly. Here's one. That's all they will get. So Nick Birdie comes in and gets two soft ground balls. Should be out of this inning with no runs. But now it's a 5-3 to three ball game. Now it's a 5-3 to three ball game. Vladdy busted it out the box. Glaber didn't even attempt to throw to first. So that'll bring up Bo Bichette now. First pitch to Bichette is fouled away. And the count is 0-1.
Oh, and one. Oh, and one. We are one like away from 350. 51 likes away from 400. The 01 to Bichette. Birdie got to get him here. Come on, Nick. And he hits him. And he hit him. That's the second J that was hit today. Do not be shocked if a Yankee gets hit in this game. Mistake or not, it doesn't matter. I would not be shocked if you see a Yankee get hit in this game. Bichette seems like that, uh, that, that elbow may be hurt. He is still down, basically slumped over. And he's getting up now. Talking with the trainer as he walks to first base. That's the second J that was hit. He's lucky he got that pad on, man, because that was right in the elbow, it looked like. It looked like that was right in the elbow. He is very... And look, even with that pad, that hurts like a bitch. But that's bad. That hurts. Nick Birdie thought he fouled it. Uh, I was right off the elbow, brother. That was no foul there. <laughs> there was no foul on that one. That had to hurt. 12 subbies away from today's goal, guys. And yeah, you got to watch out now with a Yankee. I would not be shocked if a Yankee gets hit in this game. Unintentional, obviously. No doubt about it. None of that was intentional. We know that. Definitely wasn't intentional. Um, we know that's not intentional. Not one bit. But... You know, you see your guys get hit. You might see somebody get, get thrown at on the side of the Blue Jays to the Yankees. So it'll now be bases loaded. And the batter will be Alejandro Kirk. A base hit ties this game, folks. Pitch right down to Johnson. And the count is 0-1. And, and the count is 0-1. <laughs> oh, 0-1 on Alejandro Kirk. The 01. Hit in the air, foul. Ooh, excuse me. Woof. 0 and 2. Come on, Birdie. Come on, Birdie. Put his ass away, baby. Come on. Keep this lead. Let's go. The 02 pitch. Outside. 98 on the corner, and the count is 1-2. and two. Alejandro Kirk, a pesky hitter. He's a pest. He's a pest. Base is juiced. The 1-2 pitch. Fouled away. And we will do the 1-2 yet again. Well, Nick Birdie comes in, folks, gets a routine ground ball, an error at third by Cabrera. Then he gets another ground ball, which should have got him out of the inning. But now the situation is looking a little ugly to one, two. Popped up. Austin Wells will have a chance again. And he makes the catch this time. He used two hands, folks. Let's go. And the Yankees get out of it. Huge, huge. Nick Birdie comes in and does the job. He comes in and does the job. You can't be mad about Nick Birdie on that one. He came in and did his job. He came in and did his job. The Yankees defense did everything they could to try to not make it happen. But it does happen. And only one run is in for the Jays, but they continue to chip away. It is now a two-run baseball game. We're going to need the New York Yankees to get some runs. Doogie Volpe Wells coming on up. Doogie Volpe Wells coming on up. <laughs> Yankees judge said, I want to see a fight. Oh, man. Guys, we're 12 subscribers away from today's goal. You guys are wild, man. You guys are wild. Oh, man. We're 41 likes away from 400. Thank you, guys. Guys, give me one second. I'll be right with you. Smack that like, hit that sub, baby. You know the deal.
<laughs> Yo, Richie's an animal, bro. <laughs> Richie is an animal. Oh, man. Ah, we'll see what happens. Tim Miza in the game now. I mean, the Jays are down, so they might put that one in their back pocket. You never know and just wait to another time to maybe do something like that. But anyway, but anyway, as that will bring up Alex Verdugo. Verdugo, 0 for 2 today. He's off to a slow start, man. 152 batting average for Doogie. Count is 1 and 0. Did have the big homer, of course. Is Doogie a good fighter? I don't know. Event. I don't know who's a good fighter on the Yankees, but uh, wouldn't be shocked if somebody does get drilled. Hit on the ground, knocked down at second base. Excellent play, and he almost threw it away. And there's one away. Good play by IKF. Good play there by IKF. Twelve RBIs in one game is batshit crazy. When you see like six, it's like damn. Twelve? Let me tell you something, man. That's insane. That's insane. Pitch is low when the count is one and zero. Oh. One and zero oh on Anthony Volpe, who is one for two today, hitting three eighty seven, leading the Yankees in average to begin the year. Pitch right down the Johnson. And the count is one and one. Good play by IKF. Yes, Alexander Gordon, Isaiah, I can do all things. Connor Falefa. Hit on the ground softly. Fields, fires. Can't get him. Can't get him. That'll be an infield single for Anthony Volpe. Hey, Aaron Judge said it, didn't he? I think if this guy just puts the ball on the ground a little more, he could be he could utilize his speed. And there you go. That's what makes Anthony Volpe, that's what made him a top prospect. All of the tools. And last year, he didn't show that. He didn't show it because of the swing. I kept saying it. All you got to do is flatten that swing out, and this guy could really be a threat. And again, I think he is the starting shortstop for the American League in the All-Star game this year. That was my offseason prediction. After seeing that swing in spring, and I, I think it is going to hold true. Anthony, two for three, hitting 406 to start the year. <clears throat> That'll bring up Austin Wells. The count is 1-0 and on Miza. Yeah, Juan, it does suck seeing all these good pitchers getting surgery or just being hurt with their elbow. It sucks. Outside, and the count is 2-0. and 2-0. Oh. Caleb Ferguson warming up now for the New York Yankees. The 2-0 and coming to Austin Wells. Low 3-0. I'll take it. I'll take it. Um, Alexander Gordon says, how soon until he's the leadoff hitter? Um, I would I I know people are gonna be against this. I still give him 30 plus games. I do, man. I give him 30 plus games. I still prefer Verdugo to get the opportunity, but Volpe could do it. I just want, I want to give him a little bit of time. Don't rush him too quick. Let him let him be who he is, and then put him into that role potentially. But I I am okay with him being the leadoff hitter eventually. But I do want to give him a little bit of time. I don't think it's something you got to rush. I know everybody's not a big fan of Glaber being leadoff. I get it. But since Glaber, the Yankees are seven and two since he's been a leadoff hitter. So I, I would say give it a little bit of time. Pickoff attempt, Volpe is back. The count is 3-1 and one on Austin Wells. Yankees leading 5-3 to three here in the bottom of the sixth. Yankees lead this one 5-3, to three, but they need some runs. Let's see if Austin Wells can find himself on base. Takes a strike. Thought it was high. Doesn't get the call. 3-2 and two on Wells. Guys, we got 600 in here. Smacky to likey. Hitty to subby. We are 11 subbies from today's goal. And we are also, let's see, 31 likes from 400. Pitch. Outside. He walked them. Oh, baby. Walk on by. So it'll be first and second here. And the batter will be Oswaldo Cabrera looking to make up 
for the error he made last inning. Can he get himself a nice big hit here, baby? I will like to see it. Hey, Yankees, I need you all too. You got to remember who you are. Yankees up by two, looking to make that lead a little bigger. Pitch from Miza inside one and O. Oh. One and O. Oh. One and O. Oh. Waldo off to a good start with the bat. Pitch. Call strike. Nobody going. That was a ball? That was a ball? That was a ball? He called that a ball. <laughs> Count is 2-0. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Fouled away. My God, yo. I'm happy, don't get me wrong. But holy shit. That was like right down the Johnson. That's right down the Johnson, I'm just saying. Two and one on Waldo Cabrera. The two one and coming from Miza. First and second pitch. Foul the way. And the count is two and two. Yeah, Sparks, we'll take it. I'll take it all day, man. I'll take it all day. I will take it all day. Two and two on Cabrera. Yankees looking to extend their lead. They need to. Hit in the air to right field. Down the line. Ranging over. He made the catch. Did he make it? He did make the catch. Wow. What a catch in right field. Volpe tags up. Let's see this again. Did he make that? I need to see that in slow motion. So it's first and third now. And the batter is Glaber Torres. There'll be a mound visit here. I don't know what's going on. So the count, oh no, there was never a pitch thrown. So Miza is out of the game. So they'll go to a right hand here to face Glaber Torres. What a catch in right field. That was Biggio who made that catch. An excellent catch in right field. My goodness. That was an excellent catch. And it will be first and third for Glaber Torres. Yankees looking to add to their lead. They really need to. They need to add to this lead. Trevor Richards, who last time he pitched against the Yankees the other day, absolutely dominated them, is coming into game here. My good friend, Agustin Ramirez, just hit another home run. So, Augustine Ramirez is off to probably the hottest start out of any Yankee prospect. He has now homered in three straight games at double-A to start the season. One thing we know about him is he got power. I tell you that much. Augustine Ramirez, if you don't know about this kid, get to knowing about him. He got power. Kid could absolutely rake. He has absolute power. The fiance, a big fan of Augustine Ramirez. She's a big fan. She took a picture with him. Very nice guy. He's been following our stories for years. Finally followed us. Um, while we were over at the Yankee Complex, we got to um, say hello to him. Great place to visit, by the way, the Yankee Complex. He's a catcher. He could also play a little bit of first base. But he got big, big power. Big, big power as a catcher. He's, he's basically what Gary Sanchez was, but better defensively. 
Pitch is low. And the count is 1-0 and to Glaber. Here we go, baby. Let's go. 1-0 and on Glaber Torres. 1-0. and Big moment in this game for the Yankees. They would like to extend the lead. Pitch. Hit in the air. Foul. The count is 1-1. One 1-1. And one. One and one. Brett Alexander, what's going on, my guy? What's going on, my guy? The 1-1. One, one. It gets away. That's going to bring a runner home. And the Yankees don't got to do dick to score. Just like that, it is a three-run game, and the Yankees are up 6-3, to three, baby. As that one gets away, and Alejandro Kirk can't get it. You shut your mouth, fatty. The Rock will come out there and slap the herpes off your lips. <laughs> I'm sorry, Kirk. I had nobody else to use that on. <laughs> Pitch is a call strike. A base hit will make this a four-run game. I had nobody else to use it on. Come on, Alejandro. Ah, oh, come on, Alejandro. You're a good sport, my friend. Come on. 2-2 two -two and coming the pitch. Low. And the count is 3-2. and two. Soto on deck. Three and two, Soto on deck. The set. The pitch. Hit in the air, foul. We will do it again. <clears throat> we will do it again. Yeah, warmer weather, Louise Hill would be, should be nastier, no doubt about it. 3-2, hit on the ground, backhanded, fires over, got him. That'll end the inning. Good play there by Ernie Clement. Ball is absolutely smacked. And we will go to the top of the seventh inning. Yankees do get one. It is a three-run game, top of the seventh. It'll be Biggio Clement and Dalton Varsho. Coming on up, guys, if you give me a moment, I'm going to do some work on our post-game show, but I'm not going anywhere. I'll stay right here. Got to get some stuff updated for us. Got to get a couple of things updated, and we will uh, get right back to call in the ball game. All right, make sure the stuff looks good here. Bada bing, bada boom ski. Bada bing, bada boom ski. Bada bing, bada boom ski. Aaron Rodgers, I'll get to you in one second, my brother. Thank you so much. Thank you so much, my friend. All right. And then we got to do... Do, 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 do. What are we looking for here? Let's do... Yes, let's do this. I got you uh, with the Super Chat. Give me one second, my friend. <clears throat> All right, perfect. Okay, we got a Super Chat. Thank you for being a friend. Aaron Rodgers says, where are you putting Wells, Ramirez, Rice, Platoon, Wells, and Ramirez? I'll put Rice at first base. I'll be honest, man. It, it is a good situation for the Yankees to have, but I, I'll be honest, man. I, I really don't know. I, I think that is um, a valid question. It's a valid concern. Designated spit is 8 o'clock tonight, 8 p.m. on the dot. It's a valid question and um, a legitimate, you know, concern that the Yankees could have. It's a, it's a good concern to have of where you're going to put these guys as Caleb Ferguson is now in the game for the Yankees. But I'll be real with you, man. I, I don't know. I don't know. Pitch is high and the count is 1-0. Oh. 
because you got to hope that Austin Wells hits at this level and kind of develops to be an everyday catcher, which I think we all believe he can do. The 1-0 incoming the Yankees don't have a legitimate first baseman. The 1-0 is hit in the air to center field, coming over. That dunks in for a base hit. A leadoff single for uh, Kevin Biggio, and that'll bring up Ernie Clement. But what I will say, what I will say is the Yankees don't have a legitimate first baseman after Rizzo is gone. You got Rice. You got Augustine Ramirez, who plays a little bit of first. And then you also got TJ Rumfield, who I think some people are sleeping on. Pitches inside. TJ Rumfield is the best defender of all those guys. He's won a gold glove in the minor leagues. He's a great defensive first baseman. He had 19 homers last year, but his average went down quite a bit. So if he's a guy that can really get that average up more and keep the power, there's no doubt about it. You'd want him to be the first baseman. He got great defense at first. Here's a call strike, and the count is one and one. But again, you got Ben Rice there. Uh, you got Augustine. You got, you know, you got to find spots for a lot of the guys in the system if you really believe in it. And the Yankees are going to have to if they sign Soto, which they will sign Soto. But they got to put some cheaper guys around them. They have to. The 1-1 one, one is hit on the ground softly. That could be two. There's one. He will beat it at first. So the Yankees get... The runner at second, they will not get Clement at first base, so that's a big first out. One out, and that will bring up Dalton Varsho. Yeah, Richie, I always I always liked um, Cody Bellinger as a possibility eventually at first base, but probably not going to happen. To me, Carlos Navajas, you got to leave him as a catcher. He does play first base also, but he's, the, he's good defensively anywhere he is, but... I really like Carlos Navajas as the future backup, maybe even this season, um, if you move on from Trevino, which I think the Yankees eventually will. Popped up. Who's it going to be? Rizzo will not be able to make the play. Goes in the crowd. And the count is 0-1. Yep, and Carlos Navajas calling card is his defense, but he can hit too. He's not a slouch. He's not a Trevino as a hitter. He's a better hitter than Trevino. So I think Aaron Boone actually was spot on when he said he's basically Trevino 2.0. I think that's a great way of putting it on for Carlos Navajas. The 0-1 incoming to Schneider pitch. Oh, by the way, that one just misses. But pinch hitting is Davis Schneider for Dalton Varsho. Spencer Jones is too good in the outfield to worry about him playing first base. Pitch is fouled away. And the best case scenario for the New York Yankees, honestly, the best case scenario is that you'd have Spencer Jones in center field, Jason Dominguez in left, and then right field be shared by Soto and Judge. And when one of those are not in right field, they're DHing. And that's why I said it really ties the Yankees up with Stanton being the DH. Um, so they're going to have to have some tough choices to make over the next couple of years. Hit in the air, popped up. Verdugo under it. He will make the catch. And there's two away. 17 likes away from 400. Robert says, Pete, who would you like at first base? You know, I'm a sucker for defense at first. I'm a, I'm a big, big believer in defense. There's a lot of people who just go put anybody there. That's so ridiculous, man. You can't just go ahead and go, hey, let's put Stanton as the first baseman because he, you know, he, we got to find a spot for him and, and this and that. First pitch is a call strike 0-1. Um, you know, I hear that a lot, and it, it just drives me mad, man. It's, it's not something that makes any sense, in my opinion. Um, for me... I would really like to see TJ Rumfield take off and prove that he can beat a regular first baseman at the majors. Swing and a miss. Beautiful pitch. 0-2. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. Count is 0-2. And Hirsch, I agree. I think if he has a decent year, they'll pick his con they'll pick him up. 
struck him out. That'll end the inning. We will go to the bottom of the seventh. Yankees coming on up. Soto Judge Rizzo coming on up. Coming on up. Yeah, as Brett Alexander just said, it's a premium position for defense first base. A lot of people, for some odd reason, just think, hey, you go ahead and just, you know, throw anybody over there first base. Um, I think if Rizzo has a decent year even, the Yankees will probably pick it up, to be honest. That's just knowing how the Yankees work. But I would love to see TJ Rumfield have a big season um, and really just put himself on the map uh, to be... Uh, to be a, a regular for the Yankees in the future because, again, you're talking about one of the better defensive first basemen in the minors, and he's won his gold gloves down there. So he's a guy that's a big lefty. If you guys watch the uh, prospect breakout game, the spring breakout, he homered in that game. Got a lot of power, you know, and, and if he puts it together, could be a really solid major leaguer. But um, that that's the way that that I would go about it. But not everything goes the way you want. Not every prospect pans out. Not everybody works. And sometimes you got to find certain things. But Ben Rice is a guy who could handle it. Um, you know, Augustine Ramirez at first base? I don't know. I think that's the biggest problem with Augustine is where is he going to play? You know what I mean? What what is What's his position? Is he going to catch? I, a lot of people say him and Wells as a tandem. I don't like that idea because I think they're both starters. So I kind of feel like you're you're not getting the value you should out of both of them. I think you got to make it a situation where maybe he can play a few positions and you get that bat in the lineup. But, you know, he's off to a great start. Homered in his third straight game in double A. Struggled in his third level. He went three levels last year. Struggled a bit in double A, but is off to a great start. So... You know, the Yankees have some really, really, really good prospects. And they're close. And they got some guys that are really good, maybe better than this crop, that are coming up in Lombard, in Roderick Arias, and Brando Maia. You know, these guys are on their way up also. So there's a lot of good stuff coming for the New York Yankees. And it's offense and it's pitching. It's offense and it's pitching. Developing pitching is always tough. At that, that's why pitching is at such a premium when they're free agents. Can Wells play first? Yes. Um, I, I think he could. Wells is an athlete. I could definitely see Austin Wells actually playing first base. But look, uh, the Yankees have wanted him for a long time um, to play catcher. And he's kind of shown that he can do that. So I don't expect that to change anytime soon. Let me refresh my MLB TV. One second, guys. One second. So here is Soto. He will face off against Richards, who stays in the game. <clears throat> Bottom of the seventh inning. Bottom of the seventh inning. Spencer Jones can play first base, but I don't think that's something you want immediately. I don't think you want to do that with a guy like Spencer Jones. He's so good defensively in center field. And the Yankees don't really have a center fielder. Jason Dominguez could handle that position for multiple years, no doubt about it. But I think you'd want to eventually move him over to left field where it's better. He's better at, he'll be better in left field. Pitch to Soto is outside. The count is 1-0. One and O oh on Soto. He's one for three today. One O oh and coming. High. Ooh, gets the call. Gets the call. And the count is one and one. One one is low. And the count is two and one. Bottom seven, Yankees six outs away from winning yet another series to start the season. 
pitch. Low three and one. Three and one. The oh, timeout called. Timeout called. And I believe I want to say it's in June, maybe. Maybe it's in June. I might I might actually miss a game season because I might go see the double A team play over here. And he walks him. He walks him. Oh baby. Walk on by. Sign the contract, big boy. Sign the contract. <laughs> so Soto with the walk. That'll bring up Aaron James Judge. Yankees looking to add to their lead. Yankees looking to add to their lead. Guys, we are 10 subbies away. From today's goal, first pitch is low with seven likes away from 400. Let's go. Tommy likey. Tommy want wingy. Oh, Tommy want wingy. <laughs> the 1 0 incoming. The 1 0 pitch. Outside 2 and 0. Oh. <laughs> Yeah, Timothy, I like that one. I it, It's so classic. The walk on by has become so classic. Genesis Cabrera warming up pitch. Up and in. Three and oh. Come on, baby. All rise, motherfucker. And the count is three and oh on Judge. Blow it open, Yanks. Blow it open. Yeah, I think it's in June where the, Yan where the um, uh, Somerset comes to Virginia. Call strike three and one. I think it's in June. I think it's like six games in a row they play. So I may go to a couple of those. The only problem is it's like the same time that the Yankees play, which absolutely sucks because I don't want to miss game season. Three one and coming. Did he go? Yes, he did. So the count is now three and two on Judge. Thank you, Stone ZD. It's the 4Q hat. It's the 4Q logo. I also got the NYYU pin right there. Appreciate that, my guy. I do got Cody winning tonight. I do. I got Cody winning tonight. 3 2 pitch. Hi, he walked him. Oh, baby. Walk on by. Where we at, chat? Where we at? First and second in the batter is uh, Tony Rizzo. Tony Rizzo. Tony Rizzo. Tony Rizzo. Yankees up by three, looking to extend that lead. Here's Rizzo. Pitch. Call. Strike. And the count is 0 and 1. 0 and 1. 0 and 1. Pitch. Outside. 1 and 1. Oh, come on, Rizzo. Luis Hill on a hill. What's up, my guy? The 1-1 one, one incoming pitch. Outside, 2-1. and one. Guys, remember to drop your voicemails for the post-game show. Coming up right after this, 804-592-6160. Pitch. Three and one. Three and one on Tony Rizzo. On deck is Stanton. He might have a chance for two slams in a game. You never know, do you? You never know, do you? There's a strike. And the count is three and two. Three 
and two. We are nine subbies away from today's goal. Let's go, baby. Three, two to Rizzo. He struck him out. Big out right there for Richards. And there's one away. And there's one away. Here's G. First pitch is a call strike. 92 miles an hour. Count is 0 and 1. And while YU day right around the corner, I hope everybody's ready. The 0 1 incoming to G pitch. Call strike. O and two. O and two. O and two. Hey! Struck him out. Stanton goes down swinging. That'll bring up Doogie. So just like that, first and second, no outs. First and second, two outs. Let's go, Doogie. Roldy, what's going on? Gary Fake. What's up, my brother? Jimmy DeCaro. How are you doing? My Sunday is going well, my friend. Thank you so much for asking. Thank you so much for asking. And that'll do it. That will do it for Richards. They will go to Genesis Cabrera here to face Alex Verdugo. So the hard-throwing lefty is coming in the game. That hard-throwing lefty is Genesis Cabrera. He does tend to get a little wild. So let's hope maybe he leaves something up to Doogie that he could drive out. That he could drive out. Yankees six outs away from winning another series. But like they say, you got to play the games first. Pete, when Cole comes back, who is going to the pen? Um, you, you, a lot, a lot could happen. So I, I just want to emphasize that, that a lot could happen during that time frame. But if I had to guess, probably Nestor or Luis Hill, uh, depending on where Hill's innings are, what he's looking like. I think Nestor or Luis Hill would be the guy that goes to the pen, to be honest. Gary, I'm having a great day, man. I've been here with you guys. I woke up this morning. I'm breathing. I'm um, Pretty healthy, based off my understanding. So I'm having a, a great, great day. No, Guy, I think he went like this. If he went like this, that means it's foul tipped. That means it's foul tipped into the glove. So it would be a strikeout. That means it would be a strikeout. In Furnace, what's going on, my guy? How you doing? Again, everybody that is a member, remember. Everybody that is a member, remember. You can join our Discord server. All you got to do is download Discord, go to settings and connections, connect your YouTube channel, and voila, like magic, you will be in. You will be in. I would absolutely love to see all of you come join. Matter of fact, we're going to be adding some more stickers for you guys. Uh, for the members, we're going to have some more stickers. I think you're going to like some of them. I think you're going to like them. I think you're going to like them. Here is Genesis Cabrera. As guys, we are nine subscribers away from 24,350 as we work our way to 24,4, 24,5, and hopefully 25K before April 20th pitch. In there for a call strike. That's a little Bobby Ross action, to be honest. Happy painting. God bless. Verdugo asking about the pitch. That was definitely on the corner. And the count is 0 and 1. Yankees started with first and second. Nobody out. Now it's first and second, two outs. As the Jays look to get out of this. Pitch in the dirt. Gets away. Nobody will advance. 
no reason to run yourself out of an inning. Not a bad idea there to hold up. That's not a bad idea to hold up right there for the Yankees. You have no reason, you have no reason at all to go crazy on that one. The 1-1 one, one incoming. 1-1 one, one pitch. Inside, 2 and 1. 2 and 1. incoming to Alex Verdugo. Pitch from Cabrera. Lefty, lefty. Pitch. Fouled away. Doogie wants that one back. That's the pitch right there I was talking about. Up in the zone. Inside part of the plate. You can turn on that, baby. But he fouls it off. The count is now 2-2. and Two two incoming from Cabrera. Pitch is fouled away. And we'll do the two two again. <laughs> the two two line stays up in center field. And that will end the inning. Yankees are not able to capitalize. And just like that, we'll go to the top of the eighth. Toronto coming on up. It'll be Kiermaier, Springer, and Vladdy Jr. Nine, one, and two. Coming up for the Jays. Smacky to likey, hitty to subby. <laughs> Me likey. Tommy likey. Tommy want wingy. Oh, Tommy want wingy, damn it. Yankee dogs are ah, okay today. <coughs> we'll get the little dog going out there today. Yeah, a little dog going out there, okay? Mm. That's good. Oh, that's good, baby. Come on. That's good, baby. Come on. I don't. I don't. Ross says, I'm not worried about Verdugo, but they need to they need to leave him at leadoff. I I, I look, it's the same thing they did with Andrew Benintendi. I, I really be honest with you, I don't get it. He should at least be leading off against righties. He should at least be leading off against righties. If you want to mix it up against lefties, fine. But he should be leading off against righties, and and he's not. I, I don't know why, but it's the same thing to do with Benatendi. They did the same thing with Benny, if you guys remember. They got him, and everybody's going great. Um, we got a leadoff hitter. Awesome. Amazing. And what happened? He never. He really never batted leadoff. And the Yankees had him hitting like seventh, and everybody's sitting there going, what use is he to the team hitting seventh? Why? That's what he kept him. That's what he kept him. Caleb Ferguson will stay in the game. The first pitch to Kiermaier is up, oh, fouled away, I believe. My MLB TV froze on me, so let me refresh this. It likes to do this thing where it like sends me away. I don't know why. It sends me like back to the beginning of the game. I don't know why it does it so much, but it does. The 0 1 incoming to Kiermaier is a swing and a miss. And the count is 0 and 2. Come on, baby. The 0 2. Pitch. Fouled away. Fouled away. Warming up for the Yankees is Dennis Santana. Oof. Yankees are going to try to live dangerously today, but they may not have much of a choice, to be honest with you. He might be coming in right after this pitch. Outside doesn't get Kiermaier to chase, and the count is one and two. 
One and two. Good, I'm not the only but only person. Marrero got the same problem. The pitch doesn't get the call. And the count is two and two. Angel Hernandez is the friggin' worst, bro. He is the worst. He's been calling that pitch all game. Pitch. Hit on the ground. Backhanded by Volpe. Fires. Got him. We'll see if the Jays look to review this excellent play by Anthony Volpe. Jays might want to review. Let's wait and see. Let's wait and see. Let's see this again. Here's the replay. Hit up the middle. Fields. Fires. I mean, you can't tell shit on that one. That's way too quick. Here it is again. Let's see. Ah, might be same time. I got to have that slow down for a second. Ah, I probably beat it. He might have beat that. Looks like he might have beat that. Looks like he might have beat that. I think at the same time, uh, uh, Ty goes to the runner. And they're not reviewing this? Are they not reviewing this? Are they not going to review? Why would you not review that? Oh, maybe they are reviewing it. Let's see. I think they are reviewing it, obviously. Yes, they are. Okay. All right. So they are going to review this here. Doreen is saying he's out. Everybody's saying he's out. Um, I can't. Maybe I'm not. I didn't see a really good slow shot. So I couldn't really tell. I'm not seeing anything else here. Matter of fact, let me do this. One second, guys. Let me switch over to... To here real quickly. Here it is again. Let's see. Yeah, he might have got him. He actually might have got him. MLB TV frozen. He is out. He is out. So a big first out for the New York Yankees. Anthony Volpe showing off with the range up the middle. Makes the play. And Dennis Santana will now come in for Caleb Ferguson, who does his job. Can Dennis Santana do his job? We'll find out. Guys, remember, 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 drop your voicemails for the postgame show, 804-592-6160. Sixty-one, sixty. Drop those voicemails for the post-game show, folks. We want to hear from you. We want to hear from you. Couple of quick updates here. Okay, all that is good. All right, perfect. That ready. Perfect. Okay. And if anybody wondering, Johnny's lasagna will still be hanging out with us um, on the post-game show. He's just been in New York. He's been at the games. So Johnny's been uh, traveling a lot, man. Johnny went to the Arizona series. Mind you, Johnny lasagna lives on the West Coast. Okay. He went to the Arizona series, flew to New York for the home opener. Flying back to California. Then he's flying back to New York for NYYU Day. So when Johnny Lasagna settled down again, he'll be right back on the post-game shows, all rise, all that fun stuff we got planned this year, just so everybody knows. Just so everybody is aware. Nine subbies away. Nine subbies away from today's goal. 422 on the likes. Let's go, baby. So here is Dennis Santana. He had a good first showing with the Yankees. He'll face Springer and Vladdy. Pitch. Hit on the ground. A Volpe. Backhands. Fires. Got him. One away. Two away. Two away. Two away. Two away. Two away. Rod Thompson with the super. Steady. 
I will say this about Volpe. I don't ever get nervous when a ball is hit to him. It's amazing how the Yankees live with IKF and Glaber playing shortstop. Well, they did it. They sucked. <laughs> you know what I mean? They did it. They sucked with those guys. Uh, it's unbelievable. You're right. It's unbelievable that that actually lasted as long as it did. Both of them lasted basically full seasons um, for the Yankees at shortstop. So now the Yankees have Volpe there. And if he ever moves off of short, which I don't think he will, hit on the ground the middle, backhanded by Glaber, fires, got him. Excellent job from Dennis Santana. Excellent job from Santana. We go to the bottom of the eighth. Yankees coming up. But um, if he ever were to move, you wouldn't have to be concerned because it's probably for Lombard or Roderick Arias um, if he ever does. And the Yankees have those two guys. I think Roderick Arias is more likely than anybody to stay at shortstop. Um, the kid got a cannon for an arm, great range. He's one of my, he's probably my favorite prospect the Yankees have is Roderick Arias. Um, I, I'm also a really big believer in Augustine Ramirez, I told you guys about, but the Yankees got a lot of good stuff in that minors, in the minor league system, man. They really do, but I don't think Volpe's ever really going to move off short. I think they'll find other positions for those guys to kind of fit in. Who is better at short, Glaber or IKF? I mean, I almost want to say IKF, to be honest. Glaber was just never meant to play short. It never made sense. He never should have played shortstop. Even though he came up as a shortstop, he never should have played it. He never should have played it. He's perfect for second base. He fits second base so well. Yeah, Jason Dominguez, you know, I think the Yankees could very well, look, he, he's going to, he's already on his throwing program. They're going to give him time. They're going to give him time. They'll give him time in the minors, likely, to get his swing right, to feel good, to show the arm is is really back. Um, but yeah, Dominguez, I I'm more than certain we'll see Dominguez this year for they'll get a lot of ABs in the majors. He should at least. He should. Tyler, he could. Arius could move Opie off of shortstop. He very well could. The Yankees develop a loyalty to players a lot of times, though, and they'll leave him there. So that wouldn't shock me. Yep, Arias, been, Arias and Lombard been switching from shortstop to second base to start the year, and that makes sense. That makes sense. Well, here we go. Genesis Cabrera will stay in. He will face Volpe, Wells, and Oswaldo Cabrera. It'll be nice for the Yankees to add some more insurance runs. My MLB TV is stuck in a commercial. Let's refresh it again. First pitch is a call strike, 0-1. Yankees looking to improve the 8-2 in their first 10 games of the season. Excellent start, and the Yankees needed to get off to a great start. Fouled away 0-2. 0-2. Oh, Felice, thank you so much, Felice. I appreciate that. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Again, guys, right we are right around the corner from a lot of us having the great pleasure of meeting each other for the first time or meeting each other again. So I can't wait to April 20th. And if anybody's going to uh, hit foul ball, and the count is 0-2. But if anybody is going to games on the 19th, the 21st, 22nd, I'll be at all of those games, guys. Uh, when I get a chance to go to New York, I go to every Yankee game I can. And I go, to, I go there to hang out with people and hang out, you know, do some bonding with the team. So if anybody's going to be around there, you catch me almost every single day at Yankee Stadium. Pitches outside, the count is one and two. One and two, and coming to Volpe. Pitch. Line, base hit the right field. He just doesn't stop. He doesn't stop. Volpe is three, four, four. Anthony Volpe. With a base hit to right. He's only hitting 424. He's only hitting 424. That's it. 424 is what he's hitting right now. The kid is not slowing down anytime soon. He is not slowing down anytime soon. Give me one second, guys. There we go. All right. My bad. Let me switch on back. First pitch is a call. Oh, foul ball. And the count is 0 oh and 1.
Owen one to Austin Wells. The pitch. Ooh, Austin Wells wanted to park that ball in the right field bleachers. My goodness. He got a hanger up in the zone and misses it. He got a hanger up in the zone and misses it, man. Wow. Wow. Yeah, Volpe looks amazing, man. He really does. Volpe looks great. Nothing more you can say about it. Swing and a miss. Runner goes. That's a stolen base for Volpe. Meep, meep. So Volpe with his second stolen base. His second stolen base. Second stolen base of... Is this the second... St I feel like he stole two today. No. He only stole one. That's his first stolen base of the game. Second on the season. So a runner on second one away. He's going to third. And he got it. And Volpe steals third base. So that is now the third stolen bag. Me, me. Genesis Cabrera paying no attention. So Volpe just says, I'll take third base. Third stolen base. Now his second of the game. Thank you, Anthony. Thank you, Anthony. And now the Yankees have a chance to drive him in. Swing and a miss. And the count is one and one. Line base hit. And the Yankees take a 7-3 lead. Yankees take a 7-3 lead. Great job by Anthony Volpe to steal two bags. Great job by Oswaldo Cabrera to keep up the good production. Yankees up by four. That is a big insurance run. And they're only three outs away from wrapping this game up. No, Alexander Gordon, I hear you, brother. I hear you. I do. I, I hear you, man. I know people want Volpe to lead off. As the runner goes, and they will get Cabrera at second base. So Oswaldo Cabrera thrown out. Um, He's staying at second base. He don't think he was ever tagged. Yankees may check here. Let's see. But the the thing is, oh, wait a second. They're saying that he never tagged them, I guess. I thought he called them out. Let's see what happened here. Hold on. Hold on a second. I guess he never tagged them. So there will be a runner on second. Oh, he advanced on a balk. I didn't see a balk. I didn't see a balk. What was the balk on that one? Typically, I'm good at looking at the balk. I didn't see that. Oh, they called it a balk. I gotta, I gotta look at that again. I, I swore I looked. I didn't see anything that was, um, that was a balk. But maybe I didn't get a chance to actually. Maybe I wasn't paying attention to that. 2-0 now on Glaber. Yankees looking to continue to extend their lead. The pitch. Pickoff attempt, or he looks back. 2-0. 2-0. Nine subbies away from today's goal. The 2-0 incoming. Pitch. Hit on the ground softly. Up the middle. Field. Gonna be tough. No play. Infield single for Glaber Torres. It'll be first and third for one. Juan Soto. Sign the contract, big boy. Sign the contract. <laughs> Come on, baby. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. One, Juan Soto. Lefty lefty matchup. Is this the first bomb at Yankee Stadium? I don't know, baby. Yankees looking to extend a four-run lead. Here is Soto. Pitch. 
fouled away. And the count is 0 and 1. Yankees offense showing up the last two days. You got to love it. The 0 1 incoming pitch. Line to left field going back. Makes the catch. But that will be a sack fly for Soto. And the Yankees take an 8 to 3 lead. Soto picks up RBI number seven on the season with the sack fly to left. And that is baseball, baby. That's baseball right there. Pitch the judge. Hit in the air to right field. Foul. Catch will be made by Vladdy. Catch will be made by, Vla by Vladdy Guerrero. Guys, we will go to the top of the ninth. Yankees. Three outs away from wrapping this baby on up. You guys, give me a second. I got to get a couple of things set up here for the post game. But you are more than welcome to hang out with me right here. You are more than welcome to hang out with me right here, folks. I got a couple of things to do. I promise you, I ain't going nowhere. I ain't going nowhere, baby. I ain't going nowhere. I ain't going nowhere, damn it. It'll be Bichette, Kirk, and Biggio. Probably coming up against Dennis Santana, I would believe. I got to add this for uh, Volpe. Boom. One for four. Okay. All that is set and good to go. I can switch back on over here. Got to get a couple of things set up, guys. Uh, one second. Uh, one a second. <clears throat> Well, one second. Pom, 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 pom. Pom, 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 pom. Be one second, guys. Uh, post, post, post game coming on up. Post, post, post game coming on up. Guys, remember to hang out with me for the post game show right after this. We got you guys covered right here at NYYU, baby. Postgame show's been doing very, very well to start the year. Brand new show to NYYU. We appreciate you guys enjoying it. Just right there. One second, guys. <clears throat> Do I think the Yankees get a starter um, at the deadline? We got to see what's going on with the Yankees. That's the tough thing to talk about um, when it comes to the deadline right now is, you know, a lot can change. A lot can change. All right, we are good. We are ready to go again. As, oh man, my game is frozen. Sorry, guys. The count is, he struck him out. My bad, one away. My MLB TV froze. I thought it was still in commercial. All right, now I got my MLB TV back. So right now there is one out, nobody on. Dennis Santana looking very, very good for the New York Yankees, by the way. I got to say that. He is looking very, very good. He is looking very, very good. Here is Alejandro Kirk. What took him so long? What the hell is going on here? What is going Oh, my God. Look at this. 
Angel Hernandez just went over to Kirk. He's like, bro, come on, what are you doing? He said, you got to stay in the box and wait till he calls a timeout, I guess. I don't know what the hell's going on. Yeah, Santana throws very hard. Line to right field, going back. Soto will make the catch. And there's two away. What a job so far from Dennis Santana. And really, you got to give credit today to the Yankees bullpen. Cousins, ah, eh, I think he'll be sent down after this game. But Bertie Ferguson and Dennis Santana have really done their job today for the New York Yankees. There's no denying that, and Luis Hill kept them in the game. You, you can't be upset with any of this. Biggio takes a call strike, and the count is 0-1. Post-game season coming up right after this, folks. Stay right here. We'll have the link in the chat. Switch on over and come join us for the post-game. Pitch. Outside. And the count is 1-1. One and 1-1. One. One and one. One and one on Biggio. Yankees looking to win yet another series. Outside. Outside. Switch on back, my bad. Two and one on Biggio. Had a great catch in right field. The two one. Hit in the air to right. That's a foul ball. Scott. Scott says small ball and contact everything. Volpe lead off. I'm just saying, let him develop where he is right now. It's not a major rush. I get it. I get where everybody's coming from. I get it. I get it. I get it. Trust me. But why add additional pressure right now on Anthony Volpe? Can he handle it? He probably can. But I'd give Volpe a little bit of time. I'd give him time. The 3-2 to Biggio. No walks. Hey! Struck him the fuck out. And the Yankees win the series. Ball game over. Yankees win. The Yankees win. Well, guys, you already know the deal, how it works. The link is in the chat. I want to see you. Yes, you right there. Yes, you right there. I want to see you in the postgame show. So, guys, with that being said, I'll see you over on the postgame. Peace, baby. Yankees get the W. It's heavy. Famous love. Yeah, I got to keep it trendy on my soul. I'm the most selfish person that I know. Here we go down the rabbit hole. Got a couple carrots around my neck. Self-respect. When you out of line, you put yourself in check. Uh, they don't hear me. They don't, they don't, they don't hear me, though. It's like we're going around and around and around like a merry go. Stand for truth or fall for any old scenario. That's why I keep my circle smaller than a cherry, yo. Don't get caught slick End up Sewing what you rig Know your worth And don't sell cheap The ghost is inside of me Can't take it out of me No matter where I've been